Hello there.
Hello there. Choose your Nookian Speedrunners! A speedrunners tournament brought to you by the Nook. Friendships will be shattered in this 12-person tournament. And the participants are... Avinus. Am I a bad influence? No, it's the viewers who are wrong. Cave! Oh no. Ah, no, 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 no. Chew! <laughs> Chubs! Fuck off, did I? <laughs> Drongo! Oh, baby. It's gonna be amazing! Fras! Oh, 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 oh! No. <laughs> He wins again! Up yours, chat! Noom. Oh, fuck you. Tug. My lane is wherever I want. Twiggy. Can someone move this stupid fucking couch? The action will be happening at Red Weird's channel. Why? Because he's going to be your commentator to the carnage together with Sal. Top stuff. Choose your speedrunner at Saturday, August 29th. Only one will be able to call themselves a champion. Oh my god. Okay. This is me. Now we just gotta add Jim. So, um Sal, how how how, yes. how, how are you doing? I'm doing well. How are you, Red? <laughs> Guys Hello. Hey fam. Welcome to the Nook Speedrunners Team Tournament. Oh yeah, and I am joined. Oh yeah, by the wonderful J Jam Jim. Jim, it's so good to see oh, you, my God. dude. How are you? It's good to see you, Red. I'm doing well, buddy. How are you? This is. Good. I'm really, really excited about this. This is going to be a lot of fun. Not to uh, put any pressure, but I hear there has been a lot of practice going on behind the scenes. So much practice and trash talk, just oh, filthy. Honestly, guys, chat. Some of the things that has been said in in the Nook voice chat during practice, you wouldn't, you couldn't, you can't even repeat. No, Red and I might be the only two Nook friends that call each other friends after this. Yeah, it's true. It's true. Um, Entirely possible. See, look, Fraz is already already building up Abby's chances here. There's a lot of favorites. Uh, Avi has been mentioned by a few people, but I think we've got some dark horses. I don't know. I um, I j Jim, I just want to see some good, clean speedrunning fun. I don't know about you, uh, but but you know. Listen, I've been casting this game for nearly 20 years, and I just I'm expecting greatness out of this. Nothing but. 
I think I think this is uh, this is the pinnacle of speedrunners. This this is the tournament that everyone yeah. wants to take part in. This is this is the the, the big event of the year, the Nook yeah. speedrunners team tournament. Um, it's um, yeah. I, I think. I mean, this is our Olympics. Basically. I mean. I mean. Basically. The Olympics wants to be the Nook speedrunners team tournament. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, there are 113 million people watching right now. <laughs> exactly. Do exactly. you see that same number? Are you seeing that number too? I it's am. Incredible. I am. I thought it was 114. Absolutely but incredible. That's okay. Um, but that that's exactly it. That's more than the opening ceremony of the Olympics, as far as I'm concerned. Right. Um. But in, instead of the um, ceremonial lighting of the torch, of course, it is the um, ceremonial smashing of the avocado, which happened uh, earlier in the week. Um, right. I, yeah. I'm sure you guys all saw that. Um, I cried. I cried. It was it was an emotional yeah. occasion for, for all of us. It was. Yeah, it was. So, guys, here's what's going on today. We have four groups of three Nookians... They're going to fight. They're going to race. There's going to be tears. There's going to be laughter. And at the end of it all, there is going to be a champion. So, There's absolutely going to be tears. There's going to be a lot of tears. And some of it might be from us. We don't know. Honestly, it, it, could, be, it could be anyone. Um, so first yeah. things first. Shall we introduce the competitors? Um... I mean, we probably should. I, I think I think we better say hello to everyone. Cursor on screen. Oops. Yeah. Um, <laughs> that's going to happen. We're going to have tech issues. There's been a lot of tech issues already. Um, it wouldn't be a Nook stream without them. But guys, it's great to see you all. Thank you for turning out for this momentous occasion. Um, now, Group 1. Going to be kicking us off. Group 1 has... It's a strong group, Jim. Um, some it is. some people thought it is possible possible champion coming from this group. We have got first up. Uh, some say that uh, she actually doesn't need glasses, but she wears them anyway. It's Twiggy. <laughs> Twiggy is the first one in the group, and now what do you think about her chances? You know. Twiggy's kind of new to the Nook and kind of new to speedrunning in general. I, I could go either way on Twiggy, to be honest with you. She, she could be a dark horse, but I'm kind of 50-50. It's honestly. true. The glasses are a lie. Um, also in the group, we've got Part-Time Triggered, who raided us. Thank you so much for that raid, Mark, and welcome on everyone from history. Now, Mark, um, when he's not punching babies, mm -hmm. has, I think, been putting in some solid hours um into this so i you yeah. know i fancy mark but uh, enough about my attraction to him um what do you think about his chance i would agree with you on that as well um i like to look at mark uh and that helps so that's i think that that gives his chances much much higher because you know absolutely um and yeah making up making up the the first group is chubbs plays video games did you know he plays video games you know, I saw it in his name, and then I saw him doing it, and then I said, "That makes sense." So, here we go. Yeah. Um, so Chubbs is is uh, like me from from England. He's from uh, a, a place called the North. Um, I don't know if some of you have heard of it, but they um, it's a it's a simpler place full of uh, delightful pleasures. Um, there are some other people from the North uh, in in the nook but uh, chubbs moved to the south because he realized that the north uh, is cold and wet yeah um but chubbs Makes has sense. i would say i and i i don't want to you know i don't want to upset the apple cart here but is it possible that chubbs has the best hair in the nook i mean outside of me yeah yeah obviously i mean you know okay. present okay. company excluded. yeah yeah i did I didn't think I didn't think you were saying anything there, but yes, uh, I would say yes, second best. Second best hair in the nook, yeah, yeah, uh, right. uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, obviously, Jim, you, you are clearly the uh, the front runner there. Look at that beautiful, thank you, delightful homegrown mane and beard. Um, so that is homegrown. Group One: Twiggy, Mark, Chubs. 
good one. Now good the question group. is: Should we uh, host uh, introduce all the players now, or should we just go straight for our first match? I think I think let's introduce them all. Let's build up the hype. Craven has the resubbed. Them, Thank you yeah, so much. Yeah, they deserve it, I guess. Thirty-seven months. Oh my solid god! Group one. It's a solid group. Oh one. my goodness! Give us some more time to be nervous. Yes, let's do it. Let's do it. Hi G. Hi everyone. So that's group one. Twiggy, Mark, Chubbs. Group two. Yeah. Now, group two is another strong group. Some some say it might be yeah. uh, the the fabled group of death. Awesome um, we have got a lot of people's favourite, Jim. I don't know how you feel about this, but Avi is in group two. Yeah. Your thoughts? Yeah. T to make Avi more nervous, I'm gonna say if she doesn't win all of this. I don't know what I might think. She's actually, you know what I mean. She's actually going to be ejected from the nook if she doesn't win. So it's, I would, I think that's appropriate. It's a dawn raid. So. It, there you Hello, go. eggs. How are you doing, guys? Welcome on in. We are introducing. Can't inject me. I'm leaving. We are introducing wow. the nook speedrunners team tournament. Welcome on in. This is a special day for us all. Um. So, Avi is in group two, along with. Um, this person. Oh. Any anyone anyone know? Any anyone? <laughs> they wouldn't know who this is. Can anyone guess who, anyone? who who this might be? Yeah. No. Red and I are just going for a run. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is fine. fine, guys. Come on, chill, relax. It's bloody Drongo. Now, did you know, Jim, that they found some cave drawings? Um which prophesized his influence on humanity. Uh, explorers discovered a cave painting of a shoe next to a picture of an idiot holding a beer. Yeah. And, I mean, we, we found him. I think I saw this on PBS. Did you watch this on Nova? Yeah, 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 that's the one. That's right. It was narrated, yeah, yeah. It was, oh, um, it was narrated by Morgan Freeman. Yes. That was a great program. Uh, it was, honestly, and it was, it was cool to see Drongo on it. Yeah, yeah. You know, represented. Absolutely, absolutely fantastic. So, yeah, Drongo is also in that group with Avi. And making up quite a goddamn lovely group is uh, the Banana Man. The Banana Man. A.K.A. Mm -hmm. Hampy. Now, Hampy, I don't like... I, look, we are neutrals here. We are professional commentators uh we've been in the game yeah. as you said jim we've been in this game for over 20 years we are you know at least we're at the pinnacle here but hampy is a dark horse for me i i have a i have a feeling hampy's gonna go far in this tournament yeah hampy's very competitive uh there's a couple people that are dark horses just because of their pure competitive spirit and uh hampy's one of them He's definitely one of them. Yeah, definitely. Professional, never muted. Absolutely. That um, I don't know. Yeah. I don't know what yeah, you I'm, saw. I, don't, I think uh, it was just yeah. collective deafness in chat. All right. Um, I'm gonna make a note about that for Tug. <laughs> I keep getting my cursor on the screen. Sorry, guys. Um, so that's group two. Now group three. This is an interesting one. I like this. We have Fraz. The rainbow bearded beauty himself. It's not rainbow beard anymore, but uh, it's, uh, you know, that image will forever be in my eyeballs. And uh, I like to um, think about that image um, in private time. Um, but enough about me. Um, Fraz, did you know Fraz, F R A S, actually stands for Fantastic Runner and Speedrunner? You know what? Red, I did not know that, but thank you for dropping that knowledge bomb. It's true, it's true. On all of us. So, not only is he really good at this game, he's actually just really fast in real life, ladies. Yeah. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, yeah, Fraz, Ugh. now we know Fraz. He, he hasn't got a competitive bone in his body. Um, he never takes anything right. seriously. He is the most laid-back person nope. you will ever meet. So I honestly, yes. I think I think he'll go out in the first round. Yeah, and he's not going to be upset about no, it. No, no, definitely not. He's he, going um, to say he's going to lay down and go, "Good job, guys. I didn't even try or care." Yep, yep absolutely. Yep. I, I I can't yep. see it going any other way. Um, mm -hmm. <laughs> totally, totally, Fraz. In the group with Fraz is 
Um, Noom. And now Noom. Another dark horse. I don't know much. He's he's uh, yeah. he's one of the uh, unseeded wild cards. Yep. Now Noom. I would agree with you. Noom has definitely got a shout. I reckon. Uh, Lady Noom, um, head cheerleader, of course, is here. Very yep. well seeded. <laughs> <laughs> God. I, oh boy. <clears throat> I mean, uh, I don't know what to say to that. But yes, Noom. Uh, by the way, the creator of the wonderful um, OBS tool, Better Points. Check it out, by the way. Better dash I'm, points. I'm on. Uh, I'm on commission, right? Noom. Yeah. Cool. Thanks. We'll take. We'll take. We'll take forty percent. It's not that. Yeah. Yeah. It, much. That's fine. Yeah. Forty percent each. This game was Noom's suggestion. <laughs> it's true. Lady Noom is cheering for Tubex. Well, funnily enough, guess who makes up? Group three, it is Tubex. Now, Jim, mm. you know uh, mm -hmm. you know Tubex quite well. Um, yeah. What 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 do you what do you think in her approach is going to be? I have been getting messages every day from Tubex, and she has been breaking down her practices. She's been practicing for ten to twelve hours per day in speedrunners. Okay, quietly. And I've been getting all of that feedback. She's been telling me about her ups, the downs. And I have to say, could be a dominant performance from Shoebex. She definitely didn't install it yesterday. Um, she definitely didn't No, definitely install it didn't yesterday. just install the game yesterday. Good. Okay. Right. That's group three. That's group three. Group four, the final mm -hmm. group. The final group. Now. Now. I saw some, some training yesterday, Jim. And King, King Argaroth, is definitely not going to win. No. <laughs> King is definitely not going to win. He, uh, I would agree he, with that. He is already... I mean, I, we're, we're unbiased, guys. We're unbiased. He already has maybe uh, some some history winning uh, Nook competitions. Um, now, I, I, I don't want to say that he had a helping hand when uh, beating Mark in the Jump King tournament. However, there was a dramatic last-minute win for yeah. King. Yeah. There was a don late donation. Mark had to restart his Jump King round. Some say that handed King the victory. We'll never know. It was, it was honestly no. the most controversial thing that happened in the summer charity mm -hmm. festival yeah and you know so c again red and i are completely unbiased everyone okay we're completely unbiased but king can't rig this one so i mean there you go there you exactly go. now listen listen making up the second part of group four Hello is there. tug some say tug has been, I mean, we've all had conversations with Lifeboat. She yeah. hasn't seen him at all for the last three weeks because he has literally been locked in his streaming room playing mm -hmm. speedrunners. Mm -hmm. Will it go to waste? That's the question. Yeah, you know, outside of, again, Tug being very new to the Nook, I would say that skill, you know, I, I, I don't know. I haven't seen a whole lot from Tug personally, but I do think that he is he, he has a chance. And I believe wife boat. So he you know, he like you say, he's new to the nook, he's a red, relatively uh, unknown quantity, yep. uh a, you know, a, a new streamer. Um mm -hmm. it could uh yeah, it could go well. See wife boat has seen it and uh and that's all that's, ooh, dot, dot, dot. that's all she needs to say. That's all she needs to that say. That is. That is all we need. Um, so he's also been practicing, yeah. And making up yeah, our final place in group four and the twelfth speedrunner. It's Cave Mobster. Um, definitely not a cult leader. And uh, no. did you know, Jim, uh, that the Netherlands, where Cave is from, is officially the tallest country in the world? Red, every time I think that you have stopped surprising me you come up with another amazing fact 
that makes me just love you even more. Well, I tell you, thank you, Jim. I tell you what, I don't think Cave's going to come up short in in this one today. <laughs> I really needed a <laughs> ding. You, you, oh <laughs> yeah, oh goodness. Learning things. See, I mean, I wouldn't want to be a, I wouldn't want to be a mobster with anyone else. No. In a cave. Absolutely, cave. Um, now. We've seen her driving skills. How are her running skills? Yeah. That's the question. Well, yeah, that the, honestly, the driving skills, I, that's a, that's a, that's a, I'm a split on that. Cause sometimes you're like, okay. And then other times you're like, Ugh. so we'll see. Uh, you want we'll see what happens. Okay. Someone wants a poll for who's going to win the first race. Well, the first race is group one. We are going to get racing. I, I, uh, I know we've dragged it out far too long now. Um, so, so I will, uh, we, we need to see some action, Jim. Um, yeah, so first off, we've got group one. So there is a poll that's going to appear at the top of chat once I've done it. And it's between Twiggy, Mark and Chubbs. Guys, choose Hello, your, your favorite right now. Who is going to win? Vote at the top of chat. I'm curious to see how this goes. Pudsy, hello. Hello, everyone. I apologize for ignoring chat, but uh, we're just, we're really feeling the excitement of this tournament. Uh, we've been building up to this for, for approximately 17 years, and finally it's happening. Yeah. It's, mm -hmm. it's a big, it's a big event. A um, lot of votes coming in. It's pretty even. Uh, Jim, I don't know, I don't know if you see this. Uh, Twiggy is, um, yes, Definitely uh, pulling ahead in this poll, but Chubbs, Mark is is bringing up the rear, uh, not for the first time, um, nope. and uh, I'm I'm curious to see where this goes. Yeah, yeah, that is interesting that Twiggy's getting so many votes. Hmm. It's like they know something. Interesting. Yeah, it is. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, we are nearly ready for our first match. I see Chubbs has got the game going, which is uh, which is looking good for us. Twiggy in this mm -hmm. poll, but it looks like Jack can really make up their mind pretty tight. Of course, as a winning member of Team Twiggy, um, I uh, I realise the the pedigree that comes with with, with being on uh, Team Twiggy. Mike Crackle, apologies. It's uh. It's gonna be a bit, gonna be a bit dodgy. Stop, guys. Oh, this is dropped. Is it? Why is it happening, guys? The story. Just me or Jim? Jim? Uh, I don't know. Do I have mic crackles? I don't believe so. I also hear it for you, Red, as well. You hear me okay? I've literally touched. It seems like as soon as Chubbs opened up his stream on Discord, that okay, that started happening. Uh ah, I'm gonna have to mute my audio. Okay, hang on. Yes. Okay. Excellent. Oh, you're muted. Oh, yeah, I can hear you. Okay. <laughs> but if I do that, they can't hear me. Okay, we've got a problem. We've got a problem. Guys. Chat, I would juggle for you right now, but I can't juggle. So. I sound good now, but Jim can't hear me. That's the main problem. So that's not going to happen. Jim, Jim can't hear me if I uh, mute there. Uh, okay, I'm having an issue, guys. Give me a minute. Juggle the shoe. Capture my local audio instead of Discord. Hmm. I don't know how to do it. Maybe meeting Jim would help. Okay. Oh, 
I will. Okay. All right, guys. Red is just experiencing some technical difficulties. Technical difficulties. But he will be right back. Oh, is Jim planning a shoey? Well, no. Uh, listen, guys. Red and I just grabbed a shoe because we might go for a little run later. Okay? Okay, that's it. That, there's nothing else to that. And yes, both of us have a shoe. And yes, maybe both of us have a drink next to us. But we don't know what's going to happen with that. So we didn't, we didn't plan this. All I'm saying. Who am I excited to see? You know, man, I I think that I think Tug's got a real shot here. Uh, and if he doesn't, I'm going to be pretty disappointed, probably. Um, I mean, he is, you know, one of the leaders of the Nook. So <laughs> I feel like he should do well. You know what I mean? Just for just for those purposes. But um, that is not even my shoe. It's not my shoe. It's true. It's my wife's shoe. Um, but I might go run in them later. So. The check is in the mail. <laughs> There's no chubs, chubs. We have said several times, okay? We have said several times, Red and I, that we have no bias. We have been doing this for decades. We have no bias. All right? No bias at all. I don't want to leave, but a double shoey might make me vomit. We're not doing a shoey. No one said anything about a shoey. We're going for a jog. And we have our shoes ready to go because we're going to leave right after the tournament. I don't know what's so hard to understand about that. We're, we're absolutely unbiased. No. No pressure. No pressure, Doug. But you, yeah, you got to win. Yeah. There he is. Hello. I don't know. Guys, can you hear, uh, can you hear Red? We can't hear him. Okay. Hmm. We can just do this the whole time. You know? Streams are not streams if there aren't tech issues. It's true. <clears throat> it's very, very true. Yeah, basically, the problem I've got is that I have my mic in OBS... But then I also have it in um, Discord. And so it's capturing you know, it twice. Uh, uh, Red, why I could do this, and it's not going to be as good, but I could listen to the stream and you could just have your mic on. So, I'm, so I, you know, when I wasn't being able to hear you, and then I can just deal with that. But then at least you're there because it's more important that your mic is working. Yeah, the lag will be, I think the lag will be too much. Maybe. It's not too bad right now, actually, though. Maybe I will um, do push to talk in Discord. How about that? Okay. Yeah. Okay. That works. How, how does this sound, guys? A separate shitty mic Sounds I could use for this. That's not a good <clears throat> idea. Is that better, guys? Okay, I think we figured it out. Yes, thank you all for your patience. Sorry, guys. We're getting there. Yeah, get we are getting parts. there. I promise. This is a lot of moving parts yeah. to do all this. Uh, yeah. If it, how how is it sounding now, guys? Sounds good. Uh, it's perfect now. Better. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Good. All right. Mm -hmm. Let's do it. Let's just play our first yep. game, see what happens. Thank you so much for your patience, everyone. Thank you for being here. Really, really appreciate it. Uh, we've got our first match coming up. It is Twiggy, Mark, and Chubbs.
get it up. There it, it is. Isn't okay, guys. Uh, so I'm hoping we will get some game audio. Um, apologies if this doesn't quite go to plan. But we are ready for action. Twiggy, Mark, Chubbs, whenever you guys are ready. Um, you're also very welcome to talk in uh, voice chat so we can hear what's going on. I'm very excited for this, Jim. Yeah, first game. I see Chubbs has gone with a cat. And Mark has gone with a chicken, which is interesting. I think that might give a little bit of an advantage. Yeah, it could well be. Um, yeah. It's, the, the chicken has always had a, a good a good shout here. So um, yes. I I can't remember who's what color now. Okay, so Chubbs is the cat. Um, Mark appears to oh have not, not joined Mark. the game. <laughs> so Mark well. out early doors. We've got Twiggy. Firing ahead quickly, is the cape an advantage? Is the broom an advantage? Who knows? But Chubbs with the capture. Yeah. That is that is a strong move. Early doors. Mark has disconnected. He got lagged. That that is an unfortunate uh you don't like to see it, Jim. Not not at this point. No. No. Um Twiggy does have a broom, which Oh, and Twiggy's out. That was an early round. That was a quick round. That was a quick round. And it was a win for Twiggy. I really hope someone is uh, taking yeah. note of all the scores because I'm not. But we had Twiggy in first, <laughs> Chubbs in second. Or was it the other way around? I've actually forgotten. No, Chubbs is in first currently. <laughs> it's, Twiggy's we behind are professionals, okay? on the broom. Professionals. Yeah, unbiased professionals. Uh, Chubbs in the lead. This is a close round, though. Uh, unfortunately, we've lost Mark to lag. Which is very frustrating. Oh, I think that was pure skill. But I, I just don't think Mark has practiced enough. The the rope swinging happening a lot here. Um, as you as you well know, Jim <laughs> and I know this game very well. Very well. Um, yes. We've been we've been. Not... I believe it's called a grappling hook, actually. Yeah. Quite interesting. Yeah. 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 Grapple, grapple, grapple. Uh, there was a rocket there from Oof. Twiggy. The screen is closing rocket. in on them. This is going to be a tight round. Anybody's game here. Jim. Oof. I, uh... Chubbs is going to have to avoid those boxes. You can't box it up, Jim. Nope. You cannot you box let it, it up. Out. You gotta let it's it out. It's not like leftovers. There's a crate block. Nope. Now, this is really fascinating. Chubbs and Twiggy really going for it here. Anybody's game. Look how small the screen is getting. This is really dramatic now. I wow, genuinely can't tell this. This is one of the closest races I've ever seen in my 20 years of commentating on this game. I can't Ooh. believe it, but Chubbs has taken it. What a play. That was a tense race, but it's two wins for Chubbs. What? Two wins for Chubbs. Play. Early, early hit from Twiggy. Oh. This could be a quick round. Chubbs saving oh. it from the depths. That was so tight. And now he's got super speed and he's taken the lead. What a turnaround, Jim. Wow. Unbelievable wow, stuff. Chubbs. Again, you know, Chubbs really strong in these early rounds. However, Twiggy has really made it tight in these early matches. I'm very excited to see where this is going. What a, what a start to the tournament. I'm very excited here. We've got a rocket heading straight for Twiggy. It backfired and hit them both, Jim. Oh my. This is incredible. Goodness. Oh my goodness. I can't take my eyes off the screen. This is absolute oh. drama here on the Nook Speedrunners team tournament. Straight away at the start. Chubbs in the lead. There is indeed a bracket. We will uh, keep you updated on how it goes. Chubbs, he's got a lead going, but as you have seen many times, this game can turn on its head, and it did. Twiggy's taking the lead now. We haven't quite got to this stage where the screen is closing in on them, but it's gonna be soon. We've got a rocket incoming on Twiggy. Can she avoid it? No, she can't. Super speed for Chubbs, but Ooh. he's hit the crates. Goodness me, what a race. Oh, their skills are so in tune with each other. Honestly, it's like... it's like watching a dance. It's like watching a dance. This is beautiful to see. You love to see it, Jim. We've got 30 seconds. The, the screen is closing in now. And it's anybody's game. Can Twiggy bring it wow. back? It's two to Chubbs. Oh, what a pull. Oh, they pull each Amazing other. Amazing oh, stuff, Jim. Goodness. Amazing stuff. Is it going to be a clean sweep for Chubbs? Or is Twiggy going to peg one back? This is really incredible stuff. There's a, a double butt grab. You don't often see a double butt grab in speedrunners, but when you do, it's a sight to behold. Whoa. And Twiggy's and taking it. it. Twiggy has taken the win. 
Wow. The witch kit. Wow. Unbelievable stuff. It's two on anybody's game. Anybody's game here. Now, Twiggy's had a fall there. Chubbs, can he press the advantage here? There's Ooh, clearly he parts of this Twiggy course. A mistake. There's clearly parts of the course which are easier to run on. And Chubbs takes it. A strong, wow. a strong, strong round. Chubbs has won the match. I think Mark did really well. Mark, honestly, Mark was unlucky to uh, to not actually win all three of those. Uninvite. <laughs> How is Jim? Uh, uh, your, your thoughts on on that first race? I, you know, I have to say, in all my years of speedrunners, I, they it, their talents they were so closely matched. I mean, there were times where they were overlapping each other for several you know multiple seconds on the screen it was it was great to end yeah. this is why this is why we got into this jim this is exactly it really you, is you... hello there uh, to see competition like this chubbs changing up his skin color that was no that was three wins for chubbs one for twiggy and mark unfortunate but yes thank you it's chubbs 11 uh i'm gonna no, here. Chubbs, 11, 3, 9, and Mark, 5. All right. Wow. Choose your speedrunner. So, we are now heading over to number 2. Three, number two. And that is, that is, no, hang on. I'm doing this. Abby. Are we doing three runs each? Mike, Mike is, uh, Mike is going out. Okay. And guys, I'm sorry. Uh, yeah, it's um. Yes. So we are going three runs for each group. Okay. Three runs for each yep. group. So we're carrying on. Yes. With Chubbs. I should have uh, checked this. No, you don't need to check this, Red, because we're professionals. Remember? Sorry, yeah, we are absolute professionals. We don't need to check uh, things. Thanks for doing That's... the... Uh... What is going on with my mic today? This is so strange. I'm going to detect from voice. Hang on. Maybe that will help. Is my mic also going to the browser? No, it is not. It is now? Now it's not. Okay. Uh, all right. Hopefully, all fine. That, that sounds good to me. Thanks, Jim. These things happen, guys. I just disconnected and reconnected. I might just have to occasionally do that. Okay. So, we are, hopefully... About to ready for game number two. Hang on. Excited to see what Mark can do in this one. <laughs> no! The goat. King Argoroth summoned. Thank you, King, for the bits. Smashing it red. Hello, IT. If you turned it off and on again. Okay. Mark has restarted the game, so hopefully it's better for him now. Okay, we are ready for match number two. So, guys, whenever you're Look ready. Look at that ping. Look at Mark's ping. Mm, that's good. Oh. Yeah. Mm. That's a sexy high number. That is a sexy high number. That means he might win this, right? Because higher ping is good. Yeah, yeah, that's uh, what I was always yep. told. The first Internet. match was won by... We're going to get some sexy progress. Deep. Oh, look at right. this. Winter oh, we've got a bit of lag. It's fine. So we've got Chubbs, Twiggy, and Mark. Mark is involved this time, but he's already been eliminated. No, he's still in the game. That was dramatic. Divided be underscore love sex Mark loves the drama. That was very dramatic. Oh, yeah. Chubbs is the kitty, the the ginger cat. Uh, clearly trying to get in in favour with the host. Uh, oh, but boy. Twiggy, the witch, and Mark has been eliminated. The ping. Not helping him there, um, as well as his talent. 
but it's between Twiggy and Chubbs once again. Chubbs taking the lead, but I like this map, Jim. This is a this is a good map. Yes, uh, it's it's very festive. It is festive. It is the middle. Uh, it's the end of August, so it's absolutely perfect. Um, yep. Maybe if you're in Australia, of course, for Mark, maybe that's why we have this. Make him feel more at home because they get so much snow in Australia. Did you know? Um, and yes, oh my goodness! Mm -hmm. Wow, that was that was a play, Jim. That Chubbs made that turn, and it was lights out. That honestly was beautiful to watch. Um, can can Mark, Mark have an impact on this game? Let's hope so, for the sake of posterity for for Australia. He's yes, drilling his Australia. way to the top. This is good to see. Beautiful. This is liquid speedrunners indeed. Jim plays games. Absolutely. And now we've got Twiggy in the lead, followed by Chubbs. And Mark is still hanging on in the back. Can he get himself at least a second place? It would be great to see. But Twiggy it is would. really pushing hard. And Mark is somehow still in the game. That was that was clutch. That was, I believe, what the kids call clutch. I don't know what clutch. that means, yes, but it is. was clutch. Yes. Uh, unfortunately, Mark has now been eliminated. We've got Chubb and Twiggy once again. Honestly, these two, it's been a strong race, but Twiggy takes the second round. It's 1-1 each for Chubbs and Twiggy. Who is going to win this match? Chubbs took the first one 3-1 to one against Twiggy. Mark having his connection issues, of course. But we are racing. We are back. We are enjoying some hot speedrunners action and that was a beautiful grapple from mark chubbs bringing up the rear now wow. and being eliminated mark finally getting himself on the board but he's lost out and twiggy is gonna take the win Oof. that was dramatic wow. chubbs finishing third in that one but this is still anybody's race twiggy now has the two to chubbs is one and twiggy firing ahead early doors the broom trying to sweep away the competition there but it's not going to be a clean sweep in this match because we've got two to twiggy one to chubbs mark holding on managed to get a second place in the last race this is very tight again but it's amazing you can see how close they get to the edge of the screen and then suddenly they're back and winning the race that's why we love speedrunners this is why we love this it. is this is why we do this and this is—I don't know about you, Red, but I would like a hot toddy watching a this hot toddy. race. A absolutely, that would be right. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Um, I love my whiskey. Whiskey is is always uh, a nice thing to have. Uh, it's good for lubricating whiskey. as well, of course. Chuck. Oh, that was an elimination. Goes. Brutal Mark. on Mark there. No love lost between Chubbs and Mark. Uh, Long-running rivalry between those two. Uh, it's, Here they it's go. Got, Look at them together again. It's got pretty ugly Look over the years, two. but, uh, you know, they uh, they are professionals at the end of the day. Yeah, we all are. Um, and, you know, it's it's about the sport. It's not about the players. This is, this is just for yes. pure enjoyment of the sport we all know and love. Yes. We've got Chubbs and Twiggy racing here. The screen is closing in. This could turn around at any point. Mandy has peanut butter whiskey in her coffee, which, you know what? That sounds delightful. Oh, my God, this is this is close. And Twiggy's got the win. She has taken the match. What a grapple. What a sweep. What a grapple. That was amazing. Okay. That was the play of the wow. day so far by Twiggy. Twiggy is dominating this round so, so far. Twiggy takes the second match. Three... To Twiggy, two, one to Chubbs, none to Mark. So if someone could do the scores for me, because I can't remember. <laughs> Mark, I think, gets uh, six. No? I don't even know now. The current scores as they stand, going into that, we have Twiggy with 20 points. The one loss by Chubbs put Twiggy ahead by one point to Chubbs' 19, and we have Mark with nine. Oh my goodness, Wait, thank you, Turk. Uh, Wait, was that the voice of God? I think it might have been God. Did that just... Okay. Um, it's always Interesting. It's always nice to uh, have some divine intervention. Um, yeah, that's amazing. Okay. We can, just all, wow. uh, we can all just experience that now. So, Jim, 
going into oh. the last match. Wow. One point between yeah. the top two. Mm -hmm. It's anybody's game. And, yeah, and I'm still I'm going with Mark. You know, I've seen enough speedrunners to know Mark can win this. You know, based on scoring. Very true. Yeah. Oh god, that's huge. <laughs> Don't look at the stream. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Points. Twiggy twenty chirps nineteen. <laughs> <clears throat> Closing in already. Twiggy now ahead, but Chubbs right on her rear. This is this is so tight again mark i think has suffered unfortunately with the lag issues uh because he's he is a top player um but sometimes you can't you just can't trust technology as we have already seen today on the stream but that it wouldn't be an extreme without technical issues so nope. again it's between the two titans of group one. Oh no mark's just bad okay good to know <laughs> Uh, yeah, it has to be um, Lenzo slightly out of bounds for reasons. Hey. Well, that was. I apologize, guys. I'm just sorting out the technical problems. <laughs> but we have got. Look at this. Chubbs. Unbelievable. And what did I tell what you? What have we just Red, seen, I've Jim? I've seen enough. I've seen enough of this to know. Mark got this. Wow. Unbelievable. Mark takes the win. From Dominating the jaws corner. of defeat, he snatches victory. Chubbs with the early slip in that round, but now Twiggy really charging away. Mark's in trouble. Can he hold on? This is toit, as they say. A lovely That's bounce good. over the spikes. Good lingo. A lovely spike there. Twiggy in the lead. Mark, perhaps his uh, his character wasn't the right choice. We'll never know whether it was. That is it for oh. Mark in this round. And, and Chubbs with a quick double KO taking okay. the win. Okay. Wow. This is just great to watch. Great to watch. I don't know if I expected this close in our first, in our first group here. Honestly, this is, uh, is going to be quite a race. This is going to be quite a tournament. Uh, just so you know, guys, everyone will play in the knockout bracket once we go through the group stage. So your favorite speedrunner will take part in the knockout stage. It could be anyone's game. Mark has been knocked out again. It's one win each. This has been the tightest race so far. Chubbs trying to keep up with Twiggy. I feel like Twiggy's got stronger as the tournament has gone on. It's been we made a couple mistakes there. It's been fantastic to watch, Jim. I honestly, oh. I'm just happy to be. Here. I am always up. For that was runner, really good you know? by Tug, uh, Tug, Chubbs. Even, I'm getting too excited here, getting my name wrong. <laughs> but you do tug each other back with the grappling hook, so maybe that's what I was thinking. Yes, still. But what a win for Twiggy! What a win for Twiggy! Wow. It's two to one. Don't forget. The winner of the match will, t if it's Chubbs or Twiggy, whoever wins the match overall will take the tops in the group and it means that they get a buy through to the second part of the knockout stage. We've Mark. This is really exciting. Mark on early doors once again and Chubbs has taken a big hit there and he's really got some work to do here, Jim. And he's been knocked Yee. out. Twiggy takes the win. Wow. wow. And the group win. Great, wow, there you go. Great classic textbook speedrunners wow. right there. Yeah. Twiggy has taken the win. Is it? <laughs> Congratulations to Twiggy. So. 33 points. Final score. 33 points to Twiggy. 29 to Chubbs and 16 to Mark. Group one. Wow. Done. That was... 
fantastic to watch, guys. I really enjoyed that. Maybe we can talk to the competitors now if they are available. Um, just for a bit of post-match analysis, we like to do our interviews. Um, so, uh, Twiggy, you took that, but it was a it was a tight, tight race right until the end. Uh, what are your thoughts on that victory? I am sweating and shaking. Really, really, Twiggy. Um, that's not you, you're gonna. That's you got to get the psychological game going, Twigs. Oh okay. shit! I am stone cold. I obviously knew that that was gonna happen. I mean, Chubbs that, was the obvious loser all along. So to that's what we were looking for. Beautiful, beautiful. Totally fair. Um, let's let's go to our uh, second place in the group. Uh, the Chubbs. Uh, Chubbs. Um, it was looking like you might dethrone Twiggy there, but uh, are you are you happy with your second place? It's all coming up, Chubbs. I planned this perfectly, let me tell you. Oh, Now that. I like that answer. I like to hear that, Jim. That's that's the competitive yes, spirit. Do. We cultivate that sort of competitive edge in the Nook, um, as you guys Absolutely. well know. Absolutely. And uh, Now, if you take a look at the bracket, you can see that Avi, if I would have came first, I would have run into Avi in the semifinals. But now, I get to meet her in the finals. That's is spot on. on. That is big brains right oh, there, yeah. buddy. That We get big brains in the nook, guys. Mm. And Chubbs has really nailed it there. Now, someone's got to come third. Yeah. But look, Mark, you are a professional, a great competitor, and uh, it just wasn't your day. Um. Yeah, look. Hello yeah. there. You've got to play the long game, I feel. Yeah. And... Tonight, I'm actually playing the longest of games by coming last in this tournament and then potentially coming second last in the next tournament. And then Interesting. as time goes on, I'm just going to slowly build up until eventually coming third last in the tournament mm -hmm. after that. So it's a really long game plan I've got going here. And I actually remembered in the, in the final bracket there that I could boost by pressing the right trigger. So... That that actually was something that I picked out of this, and, and I'll carry that yeah. forward into the rest of the tournament. Wow. Mark, I mean, congratulations. I'm, I'm That felt like a winner's it's, statement it's, to me. It's a bold strategy, Jim. Let's see if it pays off for it. It is. Hello there. Um, bold, yeah. Thank you for all the followers, by the way, guys. I really appreciate it. Um, it's lovely to have you here. Uh, we have gone through group one, and that was... That was something pretty special. Um, it was. I enjoyed it. We've now got a poll in chat for group two for real this time. Hello there. Our next group, Avi, Drongo, Hampi. Now, as we said early doors, Avi is a lot of people's favorite. She's probably the top seed. Um, however, I do know that she has been um, doubling up as, as a competitive runner. Hello there. Uh, some say she's uh, abandoning her roots and actually moving on to Fall Guys, um, but yeah, you know. Uh, did you? I don't know, Red. Did you see Avi's workout video that she posted on Twitter? I did not. Where she was was she was bench pressing Brent bench pressing. I think it was four hundred and fifty pounds. I don't know what that is in kilos, but wow. Impressive. Very, very impressive indeed. Yeah, so she's ready. Anyway. Now, uh, I do want to take this opportunity to mention that uh, if you feel like uh, becoming a professional speedrunner is your thing, we are having a giveaway. So what you need to do is follow the Nook Twitch on Twitter. Twitter.com slash the Nook Twitch. We are giving away keys for speedrunners. Uh, thank you, Zelda. There you go. Uh, so you need to follow it and retweet for a chance to win copies of the game. We will also be having a giveaway at the end of the stream. We have got some keys. Thank you very much to the devs of Speedrunners. They have given us some keys to give away. And uh, maybe, maybe you will aspire to be that good i mean uh, what we just saw jim was was top level speedrunners it was it was it was really good it set the it set the bar pretty high 
for the remaining groups, I have to say. Yeah. Uh, Tiny Build, by the way, are the developers of Speedrunners, uh, I should mention, and uh, a wonderful, wonderful uh, bunch of people, and thank you to them for the keys. So the poll has come in, and Avi, with 47%, is the favourite for Group 2. But we've got Hampi and Drongo. Yeah. Uh, not far behind, pretty even. So this could be, this could be quite a bracket. We're just, uh, we're just getting ready. We're getting things set up. Um, this is this is the way things are. But uh, but Jim, uh, mm. what are your uh, what are your thoughts right now? I what, let's get let's get inside, Jim. Everybody. Yeah, yeah. Let's get inside. You know, I think and. For those of you who didn't know, I don't know if we've mentioned this, but Red and I have been watching, casting, playing speedrunners for years. This is not a brand new game or experience to us. We are veterans of the craft. And I, I, I don't even know where I was going with this, but I think that's really what we need to come out of this, is that we are the veterans. And um, yeah, we're pros. So we're just pros. Um, so yeah. Uh, just so you know, guys, we are going to be starting the game soon. However, we've got um, Avi is doing her tactical. She has her. She has her pre-match routine, and right now, um, she's off to um, chop a tree down, and then carry it across a river. She, this is her. It's just. It's just. Her, it's just the way she works. It's just. Yeah. It's just the way it works. Mm -hmm. Um, and she's going to pee at the same time, which is also very impressive. She does very, very impressive. Oh, Abby is swole. Yeah. Um. Did you know, Jim? Mm. The avocados have four grams of protein in them, making them the stone fruit with the highest protein content. Red. Speechless. I'm just absolutely speechless. That's a lot of protein. By these facts, it is a lot of protein. And as we all know, Abby eats however many per day. Hundreds, maybe? She, I mean, I don't know. It's, it's kind of cannibalistic because she is an avocado. But... It is. But that's Abby. She's brutal. You know? Just absolutely brutal. She takes no prisoners. She takes no prisoners. Avenue protein. No, <laughs> a new emote coming back. Okay. Avi has completed her pre match routine. Uh, we're nearly ready to get going um, once I can capture the gameplay. Uh, so mm -hmm. let's change the, uh, the layout here. We've got Avi. We've got Drongo. And we've got Hampy on the overlay. Let's change the font up. Let's, let's make it look more professional. That's that's how we like to do things here. Professional. Protesh. Polar bear fact exactly. of the day. Polar bears make horrible tax attorneys. I heard that. Wow. That's interesting. Yeah, that is really interesting. I'm not doing tea time today, Pudsy. I am being lubricated by um, a beer called Hazy Jane. Cheers. It's the this is... it's the beer is the drink of choice for speedrun casters, mm. but however, mm -hmm. because of the time uh, difference, Jim has uh, diluted his. This beer. is one hundred percent. Well, this is one hundred percent gin. Okay, okay, that's like, that's acceptable. Yeah. yeah, absolutely acceptable. Yeah. Okay, guys, uh, I am nearly ready. Let's go. We've got Avi's gameplay going. I can see it. I can hear it. <laughs> Uh, yes, Omni. I'm drinking myself. There we go. We are ready. So, Avi is the jailbird. Hampy, the moonraker. And Drongo, Dashwell, darling. This... That's very Drongo. This is going to be <clears throat> This is going to be a good race. Guys, whenever you're ready, uh, we're good to go. Would you like me to call this one, Red? Go for it. I am. You know, Avi is that jailbird. She looks insane, and this is what we expect. I mean, she's 
she's just yeah after quinn the, the insanity and they're off using the grappling early can't be choosing not to though Avi out in front even with her hands tied behind her back whoa the explosion oh boy oh boy drongo oh boy. some issues there he got caught up on that pretty pretty poorly there but uh you know what do we what do we expect from from the aussie man Hampy trying to catch up but the screen is closing in both using some of this grapple oh avi hitting every single one of those crates allowed Hampy to catch up just a little bit oh boy and now Hampy has taken the lead they are neck and neck oh poorly timed jump by Hampy allows avi to get back in first position this is gonna get tight around these corners and that's gonna do it. Hampy is gonna lose it. Avi with the first win of this round. When they're off quick, quick grappling there by Hampy and Avi. As Drongo tries not to spill the drink on his tray and is gonna lose it. He is out. He is gone. So now back to the hamster and Avi. A lot of speed. We're closing in once again. Not a lot of plays here, just some very clean, clean tactics. This is uh, this Leaving is the crates. This is quick stuff. They are very quick. It's methodical. You can see their brains working. Avi with the slide. Hampy with the slide. This is where it gets dangerous. Hampy's gonna have to keep up if he wants to not get eliminated. Oh, what? Slick plays by Hampy staying in it. He's got to get the slide correctly. Hampy. Oh my goodness. Just shaking the edges. And he no throws way. Avi and he wins what it. What a win. What a win, Jim. Wow. Oh, what a round there. Here we come again. Drongo trying to make something happen here. Wow. What a clutch play. At the end of that. There he goes. Drongo now ahead of Hampy with a little bit of speed. Ooh, Drongo mistiming. It, un it doesn't look like he quite knows how to use the grappling hook properly. But he's got a slide there. Good. He's oh, okay. Kind of worked. But this is the dangerous part here. Is the tray, is the tray the holding there him back, goes. Jim? Is the tray... I, I, I mean, he's trying not to spill that martini, and it's quite impressive, but they're both going to lose it here as Avi. Double KO. It's that victory. Wow. Double at the same time. All right. Next run is up. Ooh, a little explosion there. Not sure who, who did that. But that martini, I mean, you have to be impressed with Drongo not spilling that martini. It's especially as it's not in a shoe. Correct. Avi out in front. Hampy right behind. Drongo just trying not to get eliminated at this point. This is this is going to be tight again, Jim. I ooh, see this. Ooh, that, that fumble. Ooh, and he lost it. Hit that. Just the, hit that spike poorly. Now Hampy out in front with Avi right behind. Avi taking back the lead. Hampy's got to time these properly as the screen is closing in and that is going to do it that last turn Ooh. that that section Abby knows that last turn. that section is a solid one if you fall behind in that section yes. you are going to end up getting smashed Abby knows that well okay well that was the first so victory first there um Abby taking the round um is it uh, guys i is it three for a win? hello there is it for a win it's three for a win three for oh, a win the scores Right now, we have Avi with 11 points, Hampy in second with nine, and Drongo with five in third. Thank you. So thank is it you. is it three, two, one each match, uh, Tug? It is. Yes. Cool. Thank you. And uh, we made, the judges made the decision on the double elimination. Both players get two points. Okay. All right. The next round is up. Thank you, God. A brand new map here. Drongo does not know the map, and he is going to stand there with his martini and get eliminated. Here comes Hampy and avi who hampy not being able to take that corner easy quick win there for avi early quick round there, to get Jim. used to the 
Oh, I'm yes. sorry, guys. Quick round. That that goes to Avi uh, for being just knowing the course. You know, that there's just the knowledge of the course there from Avi. It was a very, very quick. That, that was a very quick round, guys, and they didn't see any of it. Um, because <laughs> I still had it on. It was on the car. I might see. It was a very quick round. Avi knows these courses well. Hampy and Drongo still seem to sort of be learning it a bit. I think. Drongo's gonna lose it there. Got turned around. Ooh, and Hampy grappled the wrong direction. Ouch. I I can't tell do... Jim if it's mm. the skill of Avi or whether she has intimidated them with her her high ranking seeding. Um, yeah, it 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 could be a little bit of both there, a little bit of both. Although Drongo doesn't get intimidated easily, I think it just might be pure skill holding Drongo back. It's true. He once but met. Here they um, come. He once met Paul Hogan, uh, aka Crocodile Dundee, and uh, exactly. He showed him. He showed him what a knife actually looks like. Yes. As as he would. Oh, Drongo was doing really well there. Hampy was looking in poor position, but he's going to have to catch up, especially on these turns now. Hampy is oh. going to get locked up on that same turn. It's the turns again. Abby it's the turns again. Now we're, obviously a, we're obviously on a on a different course, but that section is a tough one. Um, any yes. any left to right section, always wow. always a tricky Abby one. absolutely swept that round. That uh, was three wins in a row. Unbelievable, Jim. Um, I wow. I, you know, it's. You got to go back to the the great controversial incident of 2004, which we obviously don't like to name. But uh, no, since you've seen so much dominance. Yes, that the 2004. That's that I was going to say the same year. Actually, red. Hello there. It reminds me a lot of that. All right, new course. Looks like we're in some sort of a gym slash merry-go-round slash. Cityscape. Hampy losing it early. Drongo still alive. This is impressive. Something we haven't seen before, but that's he's going to lose it there. Avi just too quick. Turns on the afterburners. Wow. Yeah. She knows when she's got them. And uh, just, yeah, absolutely just cranks it up to 11. And uh, Drongo seemingly lost his keyboard there. <laughs> yeah, well, pretty much. And... Hampy trying to keep up with Avi's just pure speed. What a great butt grab there by Hampy to take over the lead. Oh my goodness. That was that was great plays there, Jim. That was really, really well done. Avi taking the high ground there, took advantage of it, and Hampy's hitting some crates now. Hampy now above. Avi had slowed down by hitting that crate, but she's got to rock it out. Does not get him. Does not get him. Ooh, but Hampy could not navigate. Have he's figured out the tunnels. tactics for that round? It looks like going left early wow. is is the way to go on this on this map. Yes, here they come once again. Drongo trying to make something interesting. Here he comes. Drongo taking the very high ground, and that backfired because he just got eliminated from the top. I didn't even know that was possible. There you go. Good job, Drongo, showing us things we've never seen before. Dash well does not dash well. Correct. That is accurate. Couldn't Truer words. Here they come. Hampy and Avi neck and neck, but Hampy can't make that grapple. It's a clean sweep. Another sweep. Another sweep. Wow. It's like we were watching Twiggy again with the broomstick. That Just sweeping the wow. floor there. Just, I mean... That's what you call a baked potato. Am I right? Absolutely. That 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 is a, a big old spud. Yep. Wow. What okay. a match. It's 29 to Abby. It's 20 to Hampy. And it's 12 to Drongo. So only a clean sweep. Wow. I mean I basically yeah. Abby's won the group. Yes, hundred percent. And I don't even know. You know, the, the nine points only separated first and second, but to me, that was a clear-cut first-place win by Abby there. I mean, it didn't even feel close, really, near the end. It was uh, it was great to watch. I have to say, that was that was some, some top, top speed running. Um, it was. The, the great uh, practice has 
clearly paid off there for Drongo. Um, and speaking of the runners, let's let's do it in reverse order this time. Um, yeah, let's talk to the loser. I mean, Drongo first. Yeah. So Jim, Jim, why don't you uh, why don't you talk to our uh, our competitors? Bloody Drongo, how are you feeling about your performance in this uh, in your first group here? Mate, I'm. To be honest with you, I'm not really pleased. I uh, mm. I forked out some extra money for the DLC. I was told that skins would get wins, and it is completely unacceptable to me that they have not pulled through for me. I had the money trail. I had the golden butler skin. Yeah, I still didn't win. But you know what? It's okay because I'm not even salty. I, you know what, Drongo, I can hear it in your voice that you're not salty about it. And you know what? Pay to play should be recognized. And I, I appreciate it. I appreciate the pay to play attitude from Drongo there. It's a bold strategy again. Um, it is. Doesn't always pay off, but uh, you gotta, you gotta admire those balls. But you know what? He looked good doing it. He looked good. No doing doubt. It. And that's really what counts. Thank you, Jim. That's what counts. Okay, so next up, we should talk to the hamster. The Hampy, the Banana Man himself, uh, getting second place here. Uh, nine points behind Avi. Hampy, how are you feeling in second? I'm feeling kind of all right, but I had an avocado as a voodoo doll, and I also had a shoey as a voodoo doll, and I stuck some needles in them, but it turns out the mm. avocado was my left hand and the shoe was my right foot, so um, it didn't work well in the end. I see. I see. That's, that's, a, that's a mistake, but you know what? You're going to learn from that. For next Indeed. time, Hampy. Yeah, you're going to learn from that for next time. That's a bold strategy as well. So Drongo went for the pay-to-play, and Hampy went with Voodoo. So, I mean, I think those are both grand, interesting strategies. So let's ta let's talk to Avi, the avocado hero herself, and hello, see what she, her thoughts. Hello, Avi. Congratulations on that win. How are you feeling? My nerves were... Uh going insane at the start there but mm. over time calmed down found my footing i'm still terrified of frass though ah, i see my boogeyman were you concerned at all about hampy having an avocado voodoo doll you know there are many people in my life that use avocado voodoo dolls to try to bring me down and i'm used to it so um i've, I've learned to deal with it you know i'm not so Got afraid it. anymore okay veteran a classic veteran of speed running already uh, already and life already thinking ahead that that is that yep. is the, the the quality there just absolutely wiped the floor with the competition already thinking ahead now yes yes she did that avocado avocado winner right we've got All the right. we've got the bracket up on stream just so everyone can see and as you can see guys that's how the bracket works we've got twiggy and avi straight through to the second knockout round the uh the round of eight, the quarterfinals, I guess that is. So uh, round of 16, I, uh, you know what? It doesn't matter. It, sweet, sweet 16. It doesn't even matter. It doesn't even matter. So. No, it doesn't because we're professionals. We've got Hampy and Mark uh, to face off against the winner of group three, which we have now got coming up, guys. There is a poll at the top of chat. Who do you think is going to win the next round? We've got Fraz, we've got Noom, and we've got Chu. And Jim, early doors, yeah. Fraz is absolutely destroying it in the poll. Yes, um, no, uh, it, you know, and I expected that. I, I absolutely expected that. I think Noom has a shot here. Uh, and I think Chubex is, she is going to be there. Yep, that's, that, that's the best race. thing you can say. She will yeah, be there. She's going to be there. She will, she, hmm? she will be in the game. Yes. Yes, she will. And I think that is our professional, unbiased opinion. Absolutely. Um, she brings the sprinkles. Uh, absolutely. Um, let's just hope she, she isn't sprinkles. doing sprinkle shots while playing because, uh, again, we've had instances where that's happened before. Uh, the great sprinkle choking incident of 2009 um, yeah. where uh, Dave Sprinkles Thompson may hear you rest in peace uh yeah just it, it, it still hurts to talk about it does yeah it does yeah it really does 
All right, guys, keep yeah. keep voting in the poll. Uh, we're getting ready. We're getting the next game ready. Um, I'm very excited to see where this goes. So, you know what Frass reminds me of, Red? Frass reminds me of, do you remember the 99 season with Arturo? Oh, how could I forget? Yes, Arturo. What a a voice, and he just had such a fire to him, right? It was... And uh, that man could do things with a grappling hook that uh, I can only dream of. I know, I know. I, I had I had dreams of it. Uh, and, yeah, what an electric electric player. That's what Frass reminds me of. So we'll see if he can come in. I mean, there's a lot of pressure now. People are expecting the win. So what is he going to do with this pressure? Uh, we don't know. I'm, I'm, ex we don't I'm know. excited to see where this goes, Jim. I uh... Me too. Each each group has uh, had an unknown quantity in it. Um, for me, uh, Noom is is definitely a strong competitor, and in fact, uh, as Turk has pointed out, there has been some serious already in a throat. serious smack talk going on behind the scenes between these two, um, which I don't doubt. You love to see it. I, I'll be honest; it's it shows the the real. The real love, it, 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 the love for the sport, the love for the game. It's absolutely, absolutely. I, yeah. I can't, I can't, uh, can't get more excited. Uh, honestly, I've tried. Can you see it? You can I see can't. it in my face, right, Jim? Like, I can see the excitement in your face. Can you see it in mine? Absolutely. I mean, I've never seen Jim so excited. Mm -hmm. uh, chat. This is. This is big. Um, right, so yeah. let's change the bracket. Uh, we've got... Okay. We've got Fraz. We've got Noom. We've got Chu. And we are ready very soon for group three, uh, which uh, I'll uh, I'll take, Jim, if you're uh, yes. good with that. Real quick, though, before we get started, yeah. this and this is something that I've noticed just from our time doing this, decades of experience. Did you notice that all three of them have four letters currently in their name now that is um that's pretty special that's something you can only pick out after years of experience exactly. honestly yeah. amateur broadcasters would not have seen that i don't want to hump i don't want to brag but i think I, I would agree with that so yeah all right uh i'm capturing the wrong window so that's a good start uh <laughs> Again, as a reminder, this is a professional, professional stream um, for professional people. Absolutely a professional stream. We don't need to apologize for anything. We are professionals. Absolutely. Uh huh. Uh, right. Hang on. We're nearly there, guys. We're nearly ready. Again, this is professional. Uh, high quality speedrunners. Professional. Professional is the word. That is the word. The more we say it, the better we become. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> so we have got, we've got Fraz as the Fort Knight. Ooh. Uh, Interesting. Look at this. Interesting. Okay. We've got okay. Noom as the Kitty. Yes. Um, very, very similar look, in fact, to how he looks in real life. Um, yeah, I would agree with that. It's uh, you can see the uh, you can see his avatar. It's it's yeah, the green whiskers, you know. Everything. Absolutely. Um, yes. Hello, yeah. by the way, to everyone new in chat. Um, welcome to my channel. I hope you're having a a lovely day. Welcome to this dramatic speedrunners tournament. We've already had some Hello. unbelievable action. Uh, so if you're just joining us, we are now in group three. We've got a bracket to come afterwards. Everyone is playing. Uh, but yeah, uh, so Chu is the speedrunner. Um, I, I like I like her strategy there. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I mean, going with the going with the basic there again. I think we should I think we should point out Noom's ping is the highest, so that might give him the best chance. Yep, that that one forty two yeah. is is looking pretty nice. Um, yeah. Okay, guys, uh, we are ready. All right. We are ready for group three. Here we go. And we are about to 
get underway, which we are going again for random levels always. Um, it just makes it, it just makes it even. Uh, and we are in some sort of cityscape um, with a giant moon, sun thing. And yes. early days, it's Fraz taking the lead, Chu dropping back. But this is going to be. We could have some long games in this one, I think. Uh, in my professional opinion, uh, I, I can see this being a big, long, dramatic game. Chu is out early. Exactly like I said. And exactly <laughs> like I said, Jim, it was a really quick game. Exactly. You called it. You called that first round. I said. Long. I? You did. You did. Professional. Absolute professional. What an early win for Fraz, though. That was uh, that was a masterclass, a real a real solid entry, and uh, again living up to the, Ooh, the living up to the favourite tag. Chu has gone early, but look at this from Noom firing in front. Did Frass rocket himself? I think there may have been some uh, some self self firing there going on. That's uh, it's not something you see every day. It's great to watch, and the no. grabbing is quite beautiful. Noom getting the grapple wrong, and that's that going to be fatal to his chances in that round. And Fraz, two wins. That turn is rough. It is a rough turn indeed. It was the earlier grapple that, that really did it. Oh, and no. Chu again getting knocked out early, playing the long game. I like to see it, Jim. I like to yes. see it. We've got super speed, Fraz. This is going to be tight. The screen closing in already. Mm. We've already seen plays, some, though, by some pretty special use of the grapple and look at how close these two are now this is going to be dramatic he's fired the ice shot but he misses that could yeah. be costly for noom can he make sure he gets this bit right this is going to be really tight he definitely improves on the grapple in this round but fraz really firing ahead somehow noom is still in the game this is amazing stuff really dramatic how is he still in this match look at how small the screen is getting, guys. I can't believe this. This is wonderful to see. And that was a beautiful grapple from Noom, but he hits the crates. Could that cost him the match? However, I don't know. We are getting oh my postage goodness. stamp size here. Unbelievable stuff, but Noom knocked oh. out that. Wow. That. We couldn't even see him on the screen at the end there. That was what a race. What a race. Swept, though, by Frass. Absolute clean sweep, but wonderful racing. Wonderful racing, Jim. Wow. Wow. I think Chubex showed what what she's capable of in speedrunners in that first uh, round. Uh, that I'm is, excited to see what she does in the second. That is, that is Chew all over. It is. Absolutely. Okay. Okay, uh, I don't know if you saw, you're seeing the chat, by the way. There is a lot of smack talk going on. It's great to watch. You know, WWE yes. has got nothing on this. No, nothing. Um, Noom taking the early lead. Chu bringing up the rear, but it's not over. She's got this. Perhaps. Perhaps not. But it's fine. That was an unfortunate yeah, elimination. No. Uh, sprinkling her wonderful speedrunning gameplay all over the screen Ooh. there. That was a fantastic oh. rocket. And Noom takes the win. Stops Noom. the clean run from Fraz to take the first round. That was wonderful speedrunning action. Okay. The blast there. Again, knocking Chu behind. But also Fraz. But Noom gets stuck. Chu gets eliminated. And suddenly Fraz turns it around with a dramatic... Speed boost. Amazing to watch. This one, however, could go the distance. Again, professional. I can see it happening. Yes. Absolutely. Absolutely going to happen. That is a For wonderful grapple from Noom. This is neck Ooh, the rocket and is out. neck, guys. A blast doesn't have much of an impact on Fraz. The crate drop doesn't have an effect on Noom. What a race we've got going on here, Jim. The speed boost from Fraz Goodness. dropping through the middle. Noom gets oh. the grapple wrong. But Fraz gets stuck on oh. the spikes. This is incredible stuff. Oh, goodness me. He's fired the boulder and misses. Fraz dodges it like an absolute beast. These items 
They're just throwing at each other. The drop from Fraz is gonna. Oh, it's gonna that take the win. That one wow. round. Wow, that was that was I, crazy. One of the best Not rounds that I've we haven't seen. seen it before. But you know, that was a close round. It's one one for wins for Fraz and Noom. Chu getting knocked out early. That was that was unfortunate. And what happened there? That was a quick win. That was a very quick. That was a quick win. Dramatic from Fraz there. Noom, however. Where's Noom got? Chu is in the lead right now. I don't know what's happening. I. This is weird. This is, and it's, it's incredible. I, you love to see yeah, it. Now, Chu I'm, and Fraz. This is this Chu starting to come into her own here. This, wow, this is it. Wow, look at this. But she's oh. got knocked out. Can she keep in? Crate block. Very nice from Fraz. He's oh, he's goading. Oh, he's taunting. That he is taunting. We're seeing taunting and speedrunners. This is as, exceptional. As we said, Fraz is the most humble, non-competitive man. Um, the most humble. Correct. Yes. Wow. That was impressive. Oh, oh, oh wow. It's been a while since I've seen taunting in speedrunners red, it's, and that happened here. Like we say, friendships come and go in the world of speedrunners, yep. and that kind of action, that kind of action is is just uh, well, I don't know. As an Englishman, yeah, Jim, uh, it's not yeah. cricket. It's not. It's just not yeah. cricket. No, I agree. It's with speedrunners. You. No, correct. This is the final round. Final round. The so round match three. Are we going to see Chu? Just showing, she was just showing her, her her stripes there at the end. That was uh, getting more impressive. But Fraz again taking an early lead. This is really a good display. And and if we, I mean, at the moment there's a lot of favourites. But Fraz! Fraz, he messes up the grapple and he's out first. This is amazing. We've got Newman Chubex. We've got Newman Chubex here. This oh could be my. a race. Chu gets slightly stuck on the turn there. Noom got a bit of an advantage. But it's anyone's game. Anyone's game. Ooh, Noom has block. pressed the advantage and takes the win. But wow. Wow. The favorite Brassing going out spikes. first there. Very impressive stuff from the other two. Fraz, will he get the grapple right this time? He does. Chu... Bringing up the rear. She looks to survey her competition. Correct. Uh, and watch. Let them fight it out. Uh, it's uh, Again, it's a bold strategy. Sometimes it pays off. Today, maybe not. But however, this is a tight race. We have got a lot going on here. We've got Noom and Fraz in the lead. Really tight to each other. But Chubex is still in the game as well. Don't roll her out. Okay, do. Well, and now here we have yeah. Fraz and Noom. Very tight race. These two have been the doing some out. serious competition. Ooh. Fraz not getting too damaged by the rocket because Noom slightly slipped up there. The crate drop not working for Fraz. And this is seriously tight. Ooh. Fraz losing out to the crates. This could be dangerous for him. However, the ice shot fails. Goodness me. I can't believe what I'm what? seeing here. So dramatic. There Fraz gets eliminated. And it's two. Wow. It's two to Noom. Could we be seeing. Could we be seeing Noom take the group win? This is going to be tight. Really tight, Jim. This could. It could be all down to this it's gonna game. It's going to be very tight. Yeah. It's. Noom has been doing really well despite that really high pain. Absolutely. This has been very impressive stuff. But Fraz. Taking the lead. Chu couldn't quite keep up. These two are really on their game today. This is this is some top quality form. Uh, Noom has had an up and down season, Jim. Fraz has been yeah. uh, at the top of the league for most of it. But Noom is really yeah. bringing his A game to the tournament. And uh, you love to see it. Uh, we've got top that and slide. down. slide. Noom does that slide. Wonderful sliding. So well. Wonderful slide technique from Noom. And this is going to be really tight. We've got different paths being taken here. Could this be an impact? The screen's closing in and Franz has oh. fallen. And Noom. Noom has taken Noom. the clean sweep. Sweeps it. That is, that is huge. 
That is huge, Jim. Oh my god. What have I seen? It was so close, but unfortunately for Noom, it was too little, too late. Oh. Because Fraz takes points. the group win with 25 points to Noom's 23. Jim, that was so close. Man, Chu almost had it. I know. I thought she was. You know? Yeah. I thought she was going to have it there at the end. That was really great to watch. Uh, wow. And. Um, wow, what a game. Should, what a game. Jim. Should we. I was so impressed. Should, um, I I really was too. Uh, should we talk to our uh, contestants? I think I think that's very important thing to do um, because that was incredibly dramatic. Um, let's first of all talk to our favourite third place sprinkler, uh, Chu. Uh, have you have you got a microphone? Um, are you are you available? There, there, there. She is. She's available. So, Chu, talk us through your process. Um, I can't because I don't know my process, and I completely just was in awe of the prowess of our entire team today. Yes, yes, yes. The Scottish Chubex, as we all know her. Um. Um. Uh, was that Dawn? <laughs> <laughs> that was amazing. <laughs> <laughs> that was genuinely amazing. Dawn, uh, Dawn yep. Uh, no, Chu. Dawn was, did no well. No process. No yeah. process. But uh, no. third play. Bold strategy. So I genuinely believe that if I didn't practice at all, I'd just be able to completely win. I wouldn't even have to um, practice or try. And then I saw that you had all these skins if you had actually played the levels. And I was really jealous of the cat. The cat. Yeah. 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 Yeah, the, the, the speedrunner yeah. didn't pay off, but Chu, thank you so much for bringing us all that joy. You yes. now, uh, unfortunately, will be saving it for the next round. Uh, if if you get through your your bracket match, you will face Avi. Um, how, how how would you feel about taking on Avi, having already faced one of the favourites in France? Um, well, I'll say I can't save anything right now. I'm just going to go take a giant dump and hopefully feel fine after that. That's cost then. All right. There you go. Chu, thank you for that <laughs> wonderful... Being real. Thank you for your input. Uh, yes, second place. You. Now, Jim, this was tight. It's he Gosten. took the clean sweep yes. in the final game, but the damage was done early on. Noom, what are your emotions right now? Well, I'm not going to lie. Red, he had us in the first half. Yeah. But uh, we brought it back. We came in strong. But it just wasn't enough. It wasn't enough to get us over that line. But uh, as we were saying, you, you've had an up and down season. Uh, you now uh, are going to be playing that extra round to get through the uh, the qualifiers. Uh, but uh, how, how are you feeling about your chances? I'm pretty confident now. I think I've think I got my eye in. We've we found the rhythm. We found the rhythm, Red. We're, we're going to take it. We're going to take it all the way there. I can see that finish line. You love to hear. You love to hear that, Jim. Yeah. Yeah. No, Noom. I'm impressed with Noom. I, I think he can. I think he can still go pretty far in this. Uh, in this sub uh, bracket. Thank you for that, Noom. Now, Fraz, you. Hello you there. Were put in as a favorite. Um, you you took the win. It was close, especially with that last match. But you did the job. You got through. I did. I did. Well, the thing is, I didn't want to uh, spank everyone too much. You know, I am at the end of the day. Uh, looking at this as, as entertainment so i didn't want to just trounce everybody you want to you want to give a show so uh, i thought i'd let noom have that last one yeah humbled to the end always yeah. like the, is what honestly, i would say to the Fred. humblest man i've ever met it's unreal it's, it's quite incredible yeah. um yeah uh we are gonna and we've gonna, done this a long time we're update the, yeah um, gonna, uh, the bracket so we can see what's going on because this is very exciting yes um so there it is now uh, it's a bit bigger than uh, expected, uh, but you know these things happen. But Fraz, I've heard that Fraz, a lot. you um, you are through to face Hampy or Mark in the knockout stage. Do you have a preferred opponent? Um, I don't know. Uh, I, I've beaten one Aussie already, so it would be quite nice to beat another one. Oh. Yeah, the, uh, English Australian like uh, relations as good as ever. Like honestly, <laughs> we we were talking about cricket. This is bigger than the Ashes when it comes to England oh, against it Australia. 
Yes. Fraz, thank you yes. yeah. so much. And uh, best of luck to you for the rest of the tournament. Uh, that was... Congratulations. That was, good, that was a good show. Thank you, gentlemen. Thank you. Thank so, you. Jim. Yeah. That was something special. We have got one group left. There is a poll yeah. in chat. Will it be King? Will it be Cave? Will it be Tug? This one. You know, yeah. You know, I think I think we kind of called the last round pretty accurately. I mean, Chubex was there. Yep. And she played, technically. Uh, we thought New might be a dark horse, but we knew Frass was the favorite. So I, I think our we are again. I don't know if we've mentioned this. We are professionals, and I think we know that uh, I, I have a good feeling about King uh, heading up this one in terms of the lead. But I think it's going to be tight between Cave and Tug for that second spot. I think that's what I think. I think we got to remember Jim. Uh, we got to remember King's pedigree. Uh, he's taken two Nook events already. Uh, he's feeling good about number three. Um, mm -hmm. It's could we see a surprise? We haven't seen we haven't seen the underdog take it yet. However, right. could it happen? Could it happen? Tug. He has been I'm... like I said earlier. He has been practicing nonstop. Yes. Wifeboat has even forgotten what Tug looks like. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, I think if I had to guess this round i'm gonna say tug is going to be playing in this round he will technically be playing and i think cave is a dark horse again a very strong prediction uh professional professional okay guys we are getting set up for the next round uh, i'm very excited we're nearly ready for race number one Okay. Oh, okay, Jim. This is where it's at. So, King is choosing the Cosmonaut. We have three different skins in this one that we have not seen before. Cave is choosing the shark costume. And Tug is going for the unicorn look, which I kind of appreciate. I like it. I like it. So, Jim. Uh, yeah. Uh, Hello there. It's a poll, by the way. Wow. That's a little shocking. Uh, but you know what? Hey, this is, let's make it interesting. Let's do this. Okay, thing. then. Round one. Here we go. Here we go. Cave out early. Followed by the Tug Man himself and the Gold King Argaroth. More like King Midas. King Midas. Yes, oh, red. It's like we've done this for years together. I know. I mean, it's unreal. <laughs> Sorry, everybody. We just read each other's minds sometimes. Eliminated is Tug very early on. Cave trying to hold on cannot make the grapple. First King, round. King starts as as Tuggy has pointed out. King starts in the ice block. Oh, interesting. Very fascinating. Okay, we got Cave out in front. Tug trying to hold on, but oh. Okay. King got blasted back and is gonna hold on. No, what a quick round to the cave mobster. The golden, wow. the golden cosmonaut has half boost speed, starts frozen, and a handicap pickup. So King has really is really feeling good about his chances. King is confident in his abilities. Uh, Tug just smacking every single box he can find and is gonna lose early on in this round. The rocket is out. Cave. Miss though. What wow. happened there? King Argaroth got two ahead of himself? Jim, incredible scene. We know what's going on. We've done this for 20 years. It's fine. Cave out early on this last stretch here. King, try Ooh, King trying to make that turn. Cannot do it. Tug has forgotten how to play the game entirely and is going the wrong way. Wow. Cave with. Wow. Okay. Dark Horse. Hey. Cave Mobster. I think King. Well King's done. Got, King's got a, a, a match on. Yes. Yes, he does. I don't know if he's going to be liking that uh, the ice block 
beginning. Someone give me the score. I mean, is that going to get him? I mean, we're going to have to find out here, but Cave is having a very good showing. Tug finally proving that he knows what he's doing slightly. Cave right behind, but King Argroth has a big smile on his face, apparently. Ooh, that is going to do it for the Tugster. Cave out in front. King trying to hang on. I'm not sure if this handicap is going to be working for him or not, but there's a speed boost for both of them. Cave hitting a bunch of blocks. Another smile from King Argoroth as he leads it. Ooh, Cave tries to go for the butt grab. Does not succeed. Passes him there. The grapples. The turns. These turns are very important to make with the slide. King now out in front, Cave just trying to hang on, cannot. Wow, King Argorot Toit. with that win. Here they come, it is very toit indeed. King with the slide, very good. Hug pretending he knows how to grapple. Oh, Hug's gonna lose it, there he goes. Okay, with a butt grab. The smiley face will make King trip up, explode into confetti if he uses it. Wow, what a what an interesting character choice. Oh! There he goes. Wow. He uses it to stay ahead. But Cave is just expertly handling this. Okay. Also, Frass telling us things we already clearly know about the game because we've been commentating for 20 years. But, Absolute professionals. But thank you anyway, Frass. Uh, King Argorath. Out in front, they're missing. They skip all the boxes. Wide under. That's got to be. Ooh, oh my goodness! Be good for Kay. Nearly flip reverse. Wow, she. Wow, she manages to do the little dive, and actually slips ahead. Drama oh, Jim. All of those jumps. Oh, that jump by King. Incredible right. Eliminated Cave. Oh my goodness! Here we go. Cave out in front, handy lead, but there's the butt grab. Tug now actually in second place. Playing the long game, I like it. He is playing the long game and I appreciate the efforts. Cave back out in front with that great grapple move. The tackle. The king back out in front, avoiding all the boxes. Clean plays here by King. No mistakes being made. Oh, we've lost Cave to the height, that and there it is. Quick double wow. KO there, Jim, from on the height. Oh my. Not often you see Good. it on the on the up. You normally see it on the side to side. That was an up, you, down elimination. It was an up. It was an up, and a new skin has been unlocked. Very exciting. Great to watch, Jim. Very, very exciting. Up, down, elimination. We'll be updating the scores exactly. very shortly. All right, we are now in the library. So let's all be very quiet as our speedrunners blast their way through. Please remember to bring your library card. Okay, Tug hitting the spikes is gonna get knocked out. Uh, King Argoroth trying to go for the height very early and a good play because I don't know if Cave is gonna make it. She does not. Ouch, Close one there, Jim, brutal. but uh, just holding on there. All right. Ooh, King struggling a little bit, but no one struggles more than Tug. Here they come. Tug has been eliminated. Cave, good plays by Cave as King pounces though, right behind. A little bit of a speed boost there. My goodness. Ooh, Cave trying to go for the freeze. Does not hit it. But Cave, good play out in front. King Argroth likes the height. He likes to play the height game, and that can work to his advantage. Another win. Solid stuff from King. Let's head to the final. Wow. Even with the ice block challenge. Oh, but too high has gone King. That means Cave and Tug are in this, which means Cave wins it. Incredible wow. stuff there, Jim. That was incredible. A, an accidental self-elimination. You don't see that yeah, often. I'm, 
No, you don't. But so the height can backfire, but it's overall it's working for King. Cave out in front. Cave is is leading the majority of the time. King Argroth might win some things, but Cave is really playing a very very clean game overall. It's, I'm very impressed by it's this. It's great to watch, Jim. It is. Good on the turns. Good on the turns. Just waiting for Tug to get eliminated here. And there it is. <laughs> Called it. Called it. Again, professional. A professional. King and Cave now. The height again. This is this is. Oh, dangerous. the height by Cave is now trying to use some of that height. Interesting. Interesting. Oh, white boat. Uh, oh boy. Well, you know, we're professionals, Tug. We're unbiased. We call it like we see it. Exactly. We call that it like is a game. move. There he goes. What the fuck grab takes Cave over. Wow. 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 Incredible. Unbelievable. Incredible. I thought Unbelievable. Cave was going to steal it back at the end. Dang. But it looks that like is... King has won that group. That was the closest group yet. I would, I think in, in industry terms, that was tight. Indeed, I would even go right? so far, Jim, as to say it was toit. Toit, indeed. Well played. Well played. Very, very close. So there you go. Final uh, by scores. King and Cave. And, and uh, wow, well done. Final scores. King, 28. Cave, 26. Hug, 12. But 17. So close. So, so What close. a great race. What a great great race that was fabulous we'll take the I mean, again, surely, but dudes what yeah <clears throat> what can we say so uh should we should we bring in our contestants yeah do it do it jim all right so let's start let's start with the top spots and king argroth the cosmonaut comrade himself king congratulations on that victory it was looking pretty close there at the end how were you feeling on that last race i'm a little bit salty i'm not gonna be honest oh Okay. I uh, I disagree with three of my eliminations there. Uh, I just are you I was talking going about too... the height. The game. Yeah. The height. Yep. Essentially, that's what happened. Although the height did work for you overall, uh, but something to keep in mind, possibly in the next bracket. I'm also putting out. I am not using that character again. <laughs> yeah. The uh, the handicap was an interesting choice, but you know what? It showed your skills still showed shine through. So impressive. Thank you. I, I, I think you'll find the uh, champ is going to take it again. Okay. Yeah. All right. Confidence from the King Argaroth himself. King Midas, as they would say. So let's uh, let's talk to Cave now. Cave, that was a rough, very rough second place. Um, but how, how, how are you feeling now with, uh, with that second place finish? I did not expect that, to be honest. To go mm. so well. <laughs> oh, <laughs> okay. Girls, you mean, played a very clean game, Cave. Probably one of the cleaner ones of the, any group that we've seen. A fluid, a fluid technique, I thought. Yeah, yeah. Um, but you know what? I think you're going to do well, Cave, moving forward in those brackets uh, as that second place starter. Because I, I, we, we said you were a dark horse coming into this, and I think, I think you're still going to be a dark horse moving forward. You've got, um, you've got Chew in the next round. How do you feel about? Uh, oh, sorry. No, how do you feel about that? You've got two in the next round. What do What do you think? Two in the next round. That will be fine. That will mm -hmm. be fine. I'm, yeah, uh, I think. But I'm. But I'm actually because Chu has actually had some practice now, so I'm actually a little bit scared now. Yes, that's true. Chu did pick up her game a little bit near the end. That's true. All right. Well, thank you, Chu. Or uh, Cave. Thank you, Cave. You're welcome. Uh, we'll see you in the next bracket. All right, that leads us to Tugboat himself. Tug, how did you feel existing in this play? Uh, it felt pretty good. I thought my 13 minutes of total playtime in this game coming into today's tournament really mm -hmm. shined through. Uh, I was able to pull even with Drongo in total points, so I'm going to take that as a win. Although I don't like grouping myself in with a man that drinks from a shoe. That is all very fair. And, and Tug, I think everything you said is very accurate. Uh, the 13 minutes has 
definitely shown uh, in this play. And but I, you know, I think I think moving into the next bracket, I mean, I don't know. Drongo may have had four or five shoeies at this point, so I think you get a good shot. Oh, thank you, Jim. I appreciate that. Also, uh, immediately after the tournament, I'm going to need you to check your DMs. Oh, got it. Got it. Cool. I will mm -hmm. do that. Uh, I hope it's all good things. Okay. Yeah, just don't be on camera. He's sliding in there. Okay. Don't worry. Good. Yeah. All right. Sliding into my DMs is the tugboat himself. Thank you, Tug. Good look. Looking forward to seeing you in the next round. Well, all right, guys, that is the end of the group stage. We are now moving on to the knockout round. We will have a little break. We will have a little break. We'll get ready. Uh, okay. The competitors have got to get those orange slices. Um, very important part of speed running. Uh, but you can now see the bracket is there. So, how it's going to work. We are now got four knockout matches to play the group winners. So, we've yes, got we Cave do. against Chu. Then we've got Noom against Tug. We've got Hampy against Mark and Chubbs against Drongo. We've got some big, big wow. matches coming on. Yeah, you don't want to miss this. You do not. Absolutely, guys. So, miss this. let's have a break. Let's get ourselves hydrated, ready, lubricated, and excited. Fill your shoeies. Prepare your shoeies. Prepare your butts. Yep. Get up. Have a stretch. Go for a wee. Go for a poo. Do whatever you need to do. We will see you in just a few. See you soon, guys. You guys are doing amazingly. Okay, good. I... Seriously good.
Hello there. Welcome back. Well, well, well. Hello there. Hello, hello. Uh, a big thank you to everyone who's followed the channel today. Um, I am indeed hosting this. Um, if you are new, welcome. Uh, I am part of the Nook, as is the magnificent J Jam Jim. Please go and follow him as well. Uh, and follow everyone thank from you, the Nook, please, because it is just the best team on Twitch. Uh, and actually, if you are liking this team event, we've got another one starting on Monday called The Big Dig. There are 14 Nookians. I'm starting it all off here on Monday. Uh, and it is a hardcore Minecraft playthrough. And uh, we are passing the save file along like a relay. And uh, we're really looking forward to it. Um, so, so do make sure you check out everyone involved in that. And please check out the Nook on Twitch, on Twitter, sorry, on Twitter, because uh, we are having a giveaway of uh, some keys for speedrunners. Uh, you need to follow, you need to retweet, and you have a chance of winning. We will also be giving away some keys for the game right here on the stream at the end of the tournament. So, Jim, we are now in the knockout stage. You, uh, we are. The, uh, the bracket is up on my stream right now. We are starting off. So how this is going to work, this is going to be single matches. Single matches, complete knockout. Major I was taking has just subscribed to my channel. Thank you so much. Uh, let's let Brian say his thing. Doc Newman's gas party 10 pog cave mo pitch fork another on, weird month. Woohoo. Woohoo. Also go drongo. Go tug. Go tug. Go, 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 go tug. Go, go mark. Go twigs. Thank you for the love. Um, so we've got Cave against Chu first up. Yes, we do. How are you? How are you, how are you seeing this one going? Again, a reminder: this is single matches. It's not uh, three matches. It's just single matches. Best. Yeah. You know, first to three goes through to the next round. Yeah, I I got to give the edge to Cave after uh, watching her really really incredible performance. Uh, just very very clean tactics. Very little. Very few mistakes. Um, but I, I, so, but I think, I think Chu, there's a possibility Chu could win maybe one, but I'm, I'm going to give it to Kate. That's a bold prediction. I like it. I really yeah. like hearing that sort of thing there, Jim. Uh, I'm excited for this. Um, what if they both don't butt and just stand there as Buttspot says? It's true. It could be, you know, um, never know Buttspot. But. It's possible. Yeah. Um, so, I'm going to bring us back to the bracket, uh, back to the gameplay, sorry. We have got yep. a poll going in chat, so we won't start the game until that has run its course. Uh, but we've got Cave versus Tubex. So far, Cave has 61% of the vote. Uh, so, not complete domination in the poll. So, guys. Well, she's pulling ahead now. 69%, nice. Yeah, 69, nice. Um. As you can see in chat here, um, Chu has said, just remember, you don't know if I'm Chu or Daunt. Um, genuinely, right. the best impression I've ever heard. Um, yeah, it's, I really it's thought, incredible. I, for a minute, I genuinely thought it was Daunt. Chaunt. Or as Frast is saying here, Chaunt. Chaunt, I like it. Yeah. Chaunt. Dubex. Wait, no. Um, Daunt. 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 Yeah, that's much better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like it. Chauntless egg. Chauntless egg. <laughs> okay, guys, All we right. are nearly ready to go, but Cave looks like she's taking the poll. Um, I'm really looking forward to this. Uh, I have to say, this might give you know what this poll might give Chewbacca some of that that comp that energy to say, you know what, I'm going to show you, you're wrong. I like I like your thinking there, Jim. We're at 68. percent I you wonder know? if Chat can get it to 69. percent That would. Well, it, it it is now, and again, you love to see. Well done, you Chad. love to see that, Jim. You do, you do, you love to see it. Okay, right, guys, we're ready. It's cave, it's chew, it's the knockout stage. Let's do this. Let's let's 
speed run. Let's play speedrunners. Okay. Let's run some speed. The great saying. We're on the SS Royale for our first round here. Oh, what a great ship. Uh, we've got Cave, the shark. We've got Chu, the unicorn. Unlocking the new skin. Will that have the effect? Chu is in the lead. Early doors. Very excited. Ooh, but what a, what a grapple by grab. Cave. That was outstanding work. However, this is far from over. Chu taking the shorter route, which means she is still very much in this race. Clearly getting warmed up from the first round. This is excellent to see. Cave, of course, ran King really close in the group stage. Yes. And uh, we'll, we'll feel a bit aggrieved to, be, to have to play this extra match. But she's got a match on her hands here with Chu. The unicorn power. Uh, the power of the horn compels her. It's yes. impressive to see. And uh, the grappling has very much improved. However, it got stuck there slightly on the down slope. Chu now has... Uh, Cave, sorry, has the advantage. Can she press it? Can she finish this game off? Chu hits the boxes and we are so close. Surely it's a matter of time unless Chu can turn this around. Wow. What a game. This is really tense here. Really, really tense. Wow. I can't believe what I'm seeing here. But Chu is oh. finally knocked out. That was solid once again by Cave. Chu held her own she there. She really did. That was that was a close match. If anyone thought any of these knockout games were going to be quick, you are definitely wrong because these are going to be some big matches. I'm looking forward to this. We may see some clean sweeps. We may see some three zeros, but it doesn't mean it's going to be tight. And look at this. Cave and Chu really, really close on this early run in this second match. And the lovely grapple there from Chew, that was wonderful to see, but she hits the crates. That's not so ideal. And suddenly, Cave blasts ahead with a huge lead. Can Chu close this down? I really don't know. It's again very methodical by Cave. Cave is just it's it's she's like the energizer bunny. She keeps wow. on going and going, and it's it's strong. It's strong. And that's a two-nil lead for Cave. Can Chu turn this around? One more win for Cave, and she is through to the next round where she will meet Twiggy, who won her group. It's an exciting half of the bracket, I have to say, Jim. I'm looking forward to seeing where this goes. But uh, we Absolutely. could end up having... We could end up having uh, some, some global battles going on here. Right now, we've got the Netherlands against the US. Um... Depends on your sport, of course, but in, in speedrunner terms, obviously the uh, the biggest nation is Greenland, as we know. Um, of course. Just hugely represented. Ab absolutely. Uh, uh, an incredible, an incredible team. Uh, it could also be Netherlands against Scotland. Um, sometimes it's hard to tell. Could be Veronimo. Good point uh, from Veronimo. We've got Cave in the lead, but Chu's this game is not going giving on. It easily. Oh, this is yes. close. This is close. Chu really now cannot afford to make a mistake. She's got to try and close that gap. But the crate block, and surely now it's all over. Oh. How is this still going? Oh. This is incredible stuff, Jim. I can't believe what I'm seeing, but there it is. There's the elimination, oh. and it was on height again. Chu going with the higher path. It was a flawless victory, but I tell you all what, right. Jim, that... Yeah, that was close. That was that was some yeah. really good, solid racing. I enjoyed that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you you got to give Chu uh, some some credit there. Uh, she really held on to that and did not give that one to Cave. So well done. That was a solid game. Let's talk to our competitors because uh, they deserve to to talk. First of all, we'll talk to the victor, uh, Cave. You are through to the next round. Obviously, you didn't win your group, but you've 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 come through that extra game you fight face twiggy next how how are you feeling about your chances um well first of all i want to i want to say to you you are amazing thank you for that uh, that was that was wonderful um but uh twiggy battling against twiggy that's 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 i'm scared it's going to be uh, we we're, we're looking forward to it do you have any uh tactics you can uh, employ any anything you haven't used yet against uh, twiggy or is it just going to be You've been very methodical. It's been good to watch. Is it going to be some more clean speed running? I mean, that, that's only that's only 
the question, I suppose. Very much like uh, the Dutch have total football. Cave has been showing total speed running. We look forward to seeing you mm -hmm. in the next round. Congratulations. Very classy, Congratulations. too. Congratulations. Cave is exceptionally classy. Love it. And Chu, an excellent uh, match from you there. Yes, it was three to nothing, but you really, you pulled it out of the bag there. That was... Um, that was a strong race. I, I hope you enjoyed that. Um, how, how do you feel you performed? I really did. Thank you so much. I really enjoyed that match with Cave. It was uh, fair. She did a really good job just completely destroying me. Um, but I, I just did better than I did last time. That's really all you can do is just try to keep improving. So to anyone out there, uh, cough, tug, cough, uh, who just struggles with getting better, just keep playing and you're, you're going to get it. There you go. So wow. um, there we go. very nice of Chu to... Uh, Move to, I think, Australia. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I think she, I think she did. Wow. <laughs> Another Aussie All right. first can destroy, apparently. It's, again, look, the smack talk is starting, Jim. and, and It is. I'm enjoying this. I, uh, I, feel I am like, enjoying it. I feel like the players are at the top of their game, not just in the game, but uh, in, in terms right. of the the back and forth, the banter. It's, it's it, This is what we want to see. All right. So that was Cave Bex. That was Cave Bex. In in that round. So next we have Noom Tug and Noom, Noom against Tug. Who is going to win this one? Now we we don't like to have favorites. Now, okay, so Tug is No, we're completely unbiased. Tug is the dad of the Nook, you would say. And he's hoping to go farther than anyone else in this tournament. Well, well said. Well, well said, Red. And I think that is banter, if I've ever seen one. I think, I think, uh, Bant. it's, it's uh, there, the banter has to be a part of speedrunning. If you, if you have, if you just, if you're new to this, Jim and I have been casting this for, for a long time. We are absolute Decades. professionals. Professionals. Total professionals. And, uh, mm -hmm. You need to, you really need to see the banter. Um, <laughs> it's banter if ever I've seen one. Just it, that's the kind of thing <laughs> that you get from from true casters, uh, professionals. Look, we are. We know the pressure. We know this is bigger than Fortnite, than any yeah. sport like the NBA playoffs. Small right. fry. Yeah. Okay. A ball. This is speed running. Exactly. Exactly. Now, this poll is uh, going closer than I expected. Um, me too. Uh, me thinks there might be some Tuggian influence on the poll. Um, Could be. Yeah. It's potential. But if... Can Tug pull this out of the bag? It could be. Noom even voted for Tug. Putting the mockers on. Look at that. That the, the that I like that. I like to see that. Yeah, a little bit of brown nosing there, you know. I I I I can appreciate it. Uh, he, you know, here's the thing. Uh, if it's going to be incredibly disappointing for Noom if he does not move on to the next round, and I think he knows that. So it could be there's a little bit of pressure, um, maybe mounting. So maybe he's trying to pass some of that off to Tug. I don't know. You know. Uh, it's again. It's a bold strategy. Uh, I nearly called you Cotton then, but I didn't because I'm a professional. And uh, yeah, we are going to be starting the match very soon. The poll is nearly up. It's 63% for Noom, 37% for Tug. So almost a two to one. Um, yeah. Is this TAS Scarecrow? Uh, I don't know what you mean. Uh, this is the Nook Speedrunners Tournament. This is absolutely tas i don't know what exactly that means but i believe it is yeah because we're professionals we are professionals okay Noom taking the ball. let's get the game ready let's do it and uh players are ready we've got tug the speedrunner we've got noom the kitty let's speed run jim I can't wait take us through it will do red Okay, we're on the boat. Nice. Here they go. On the SS Royale. 
out front early is the tugboat, but completely losing it at at a fast rate was is Noom ahead. Noom trying to fire rockets early on, not giving Tug any sort of space. Tug getting some some block boxes there or some bricks rather. Noom playing it well. But Tug with a grapple. Okay, so we we have a maybe a little bit of a cave back situation here where Tug is really well. Okay, I spoke too soon. But there you go. Uh, Noom with the first round I goes to the Aussie. I feel like you called that, Jim. Uh, you, you knew I it was think coming. I did. You knew it was coming. I did. I did. Oh Another early God. defeat by Tug. This is going to be a super fast round, I think. Uh, as we head into the final one here. Here they come. Tug's seemingly just trying to speed this contest up a little. But here they go. Tug not giving up first place so easily. Noom now passes him. And the blocks. Tug, good shift there. But Noom snuck through there somehow. I think he just grafted through that uh, blockade. Not real sure how that worked. Possibly some cheating going on. I unclear. Unclear what happened there. Good grapples. Noom hitting that final crate, but Tug holding his own on this one, getting a feel for the course. Oh, the boost. Gonna the have boost. To jump over that box. Oh, that box. Yeah, that wrecked it. And that is your winner. So, uh, Noom sweeping the thing. Uh, back to you, Red. Speedrunners are a, is a tough is a tough sport, and uh, it is brutal. Good on good on Tug for showing how to speedrun losing. Uh, I was I was impressed. Mm hmm. Well done. Um, so, uh, Noom, let's. Uh, congratulations on moving moving ahead in the bracket. How did you feel um, uh, beating Tugboat on that one? Well, thank you, Jim. Um, I'm not going to lie, Jim. I feel I feel a little bad. Feel a little guilty. Um, but you know, Tugboat is a game. Unfortunately, his a game is is just not enough at this level of the competition. I I agree. I agree. Your a game is almost like triple A game. That's correct, say. yes. Yeah, yeah. That's the type yeah. of A game we bring around here. It's the triple A. Absolutely. Professional to the end. Thank you so much, Noom. Uh, Tug, you know what? You gave it your all there, and it feels like you were getting the hang of the course there at the end. Uh, how, how are you feeling? Not feeling great, Jim. Uh, okay. i got to be honest, not feeling great. Uh, yeah. Kind of feel like lag was a little bit against me there due to the uh, the ping situation. I thought I had him trapped there behind a door at one point, and he just uh, snuck through. Yeah. But, you know, you got to go with the breaks that you're given. Uh, I'm honestly pretty proud of myself to have uh, made it this far. So, you know, um, well, granted, you you could literally only make it this far, but I'm proud of myself for making it this far. Yeah. Congratulations, Tug, on making it this far. And I, I appreciate, I for one, appreciate uh, the excuses of the ping. I, I do I do appreciate that. What about you, Red? I, um, it's the first, I'm surprised it's taken this long for for that uh, to be mentioned. Um, yeah. But uh, this is, this is speedrunners. And this is speedrunners. Hello there. That's just, that's just how it works. Uh, ping. It is. is. Very much part of it. Speaking of ping, our next game we have got some some heavy ping again so this could be a really really good race jim we've got hampy against mark next wow yeah this is going to be uh this is going to be a long i think this is going to be a dragged out battle i am um, i'm up for this one we've got the falcon and the moon the race is on it's going to win guys this one Wow. Hampy is Hampy. racing ahead of the pole. Nine immediately. This is. Wait, guys, I've got some um, controller issues. So, can we just uh, flick to the other screen while I restart? Of course, my okay, okay man, so technical issues are. So, as we know, Jim, it's not a it's not a speedrun tournament it. without technical issues. No, no, and I also appreciate uh, Mark early with the excuses. Right, I think it's true. I mean, um. His his username is part time triggered. Did you know, however, he is a full time dickhead? Um, oh. it, comes, it just comes with the territory. Uh, yeah, I did not know. Interesting. But uh, but you know that that can yeah. that really can have an effect on 
yeah. the gameplay. And actually, it, it could see him through. Yeah. yeah. Could this be? Could this be a tactic, Jim? I think it could be a tactic. Uh, I think it could be. And, um, you know, uh, the, the ping has, has been an issue. The ping has certainly been an issue for, for some. But um, the, true, the, true, the true champions will still reign, I feel. Uh, so regardless of what goes on here, uh, I feel like we're going to get an accurate representation of that, that person. Um, as this is the runner. This, is, this um, is a big game as well, Jim, because the winner of this will go through to play Fraz in the quarterfinals. That's a big one. Yeah. Yeah, that's not e going to be an easy uh, route to the finals, uh, having to go through Fras. Um, we've also, uh, I do not envy. It's nice to see uh, Hi back in chat. Uh, nice to see you. I'm Red. Uh, mm -hmm. I'm very excited for this. I think we are looking like we're nearly ready to go. Um, however, there is very high ping. I don't know if you guys uh, playing can see. Your ping is at 1,000 right now. Um, so we might have some issues. Not bad. Not bad. You know, and, and Red, I think this brings us to something we should maybe discuss. I feel like Australia should just sort of move closer to, you know what I mean? It just, it feels like it's really out there. Uh, and maybe we should just advocate for a closer move. I think, I think that's possible, Jim. The I rest of us. We've got grappling hooks. We know. Uh, maybe we can just make a uh, a big grapple hook like Chu has uh, suggested. Um, grapple it. Strap some. T I mean, tug tug is giving some strap some tugboats to it. Right. That, that could also work, uh, Jim. Pull it. Pull the thing. I I agree. Uh, no, no, no. You stay right. away. Well, Hampy well... Hampy has taken the poll with seventy three percent of the vote. Uh, it looks like we're ready to go. The ping has dropped, right. uh, so I don't know Good. how that's going to affect our players, but we are ready to go, guys. But we may as well go while it exists better. Okay, so, Ampy against Mark. Take it away, Red. Uh, pins is subscribed. Thank you so much. And so we have got the Moon Doctor, King, the King. <laughs> Mark, even close as the yes. I don't even know what that is. I in all he's my a, time as a speedrun caster, Jim, I don't even know the, what that is. The the he's a he's he's the chicken, he's a chicken man. I think. He's a chicken man. But will he get that cluck victory? Will he? That's the question. Or will he lay an egg? It, it, again, could it's a bold strategy? It might pay off. He's hit the crates though, Jim. Uh -huh. This is going to be. I'm I'm calling this. This is going to be the closest race of the tournament. I'm calling it, it now. It might be. Okay. I'm All seeing, right. I'm Red. seeing a three-two here. Look I'm at seeing that a three-two. Mark is right on it now. He had the ping issues in the group stage, but actually, look at him go now. Um, it's it's beautiful to watch. He's uh, you know, he's yeah. winging it. Um. It is majestic to watch that chicken. He's run. got a feather touch. It's indeed abs absolutely Ooh, great. However, chicken... that from Hampy was nice to see. He did get hit by the crates. However, this could. Ju I, I hope these guys know that um, we do want to go offline at some point. Um, so we need yeah. a winner. We're gonna need but a winner. I tell you what, we've got point. a thirty-second timer on go. the clock now, guys. Yes, we, we initiated that because we're professionals. Um, I, Ooh, another phase through the ping, I think, is, is causing that. The there's a little bit out. of lag. The rocket there didn't quite pay off for Mark. Hampy and Mark so close here. The lead is changing hands all the time. We've got 10 seconds left. Who's going to be in front when the bomb goes off? That's the question. Wow. This is so tight, Jim. What a race. Unreal. I can't believe what we're seeing here. And the bomb's going off. The screen's going to come in. Hampy has taken the lead. And oh my goodness. I can't believe what I'm seeing here. The closest race. Wow. Closest race so far in the tournament. We could be I think so. calling this next year at this rate. But Yes, we could. The screen is closing in. But these two are so close together. The grapple doesn't quite pay off a mark. Could that be a fatal mistake? Or can he bring it back? He can bring it back. This is incredible stuff. 
I can't believe what I'm wow. watching. Mark has taken the wow. lead. Oh, and he hits the crates. He got tackled by Hampy. This is incredible stuff. Look how small. Are we going to get the, the fabled postage stamp screen? Does it? Is it going to happen in this Everyone. tournament? We are getting towards the postage stamp. Feel free to make a sandwich. Uh... I can't. We'll be we'll be here when you get I, back. I can't believe this, guys. This, what a race, what a tournament, what a day to be alive. Can you believe what we're wow. seeing? Mark Look at how crate. small. Hampy hits the crate. This, this is so close. The turn. They both nail the turn. There is so little between these two speedrunners. This is gonna be an epic battle. But Hampy oh. just gets there in the wow. end. Wow. What a wow. race, Jim. In all my years, I've never seen anything that like that. That might be the smallest screen I've ever seen at, in a speedrunner tournament. Absolutely. Two players at the top of their game. They want it. They won't both want it so badly. You can see So we've got a 1-0 lead to Hampy, but this is far from over, guys. Remember, the winner of this plays Fraz, and I feel like these two really are on their game. Fraz is going to have mm. to watch out because we've got some serious speedrunning action going on right here. I'm very Indeed. excited to see this. Mark and Hampy both taking the bottom route. Mark hits the crates. Could that be fatal for him now? Fraz says he's worried. And, well, he should be. Or is he just, again, passing? It could be, yeah, it could be very possible. Mark fires the ice shot, but he was actually ahead at the time. This is going to be really close. The speed boost, Ooh. the blow up thing. I think it's called a bomb. <laughs> a bomb yeah, 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 the blow up thing. The chicken is flapping away. But again, what a close race. What a close race. Honestly, this, can you not see? This is the best sport. This is absolutely wonderful In stuff. In the world. In the world. Yeah. Just, this is, this is where we are. This is the pinnacle of athleticism and human achievement right here and we have got two glorious speedrunners at work mark in the lead the and timer is on jim we have 30 wow. seconds by the way i i mean two incredibly handsome contestants as well i think that should be noted which is probably why this can is so you take close. over jim i've got to disconnect absolutely is not giving up too easily though in about five seconds the we're gonna start to close this gap hampy i don't know what happened there just slowed down out of nowhere but we are officially closing in first time triggered trying to decide to take the top route with the speed boost and the grapples grappling well ooh, but hitting almost every crate allowing hampy to catch back up but those turns have been rough for hampy uh, in this race, this could this could be the end of Hampy, and it is. Mark, part-time trader takes that one. It is one one. I am back, Jim, so I will take over if that's okay. What a race we got you going got on here, dude. Back to you, Red. What? Thank you, Jim. Over to you, Jim. Back to Thank you, Red. Thank you, Jim. Okay, let's crack on with this race. We've got Mark in the lead. We have got Hampy, however, taking it on, and this. What a grapple by Mark. Oh, that could be the fatal blow. Wow. What an absolute move. He's taken wow. it. That. Wow. What a play. The, the crapple. The the, the crapple uh, is a, a classic move. The crapple. The crapple. The crapple. He gave it to him. It was wonderful to see. That was an incredible move. It's 2-1 to Mark. The, it rocket. comes excellent stuff from Hampy. Taking the lead. Can he force... It to go to the final race. I called it at the start. I said this was going to be close. It really wow. has been an incredible advert, advert for this sport. The grapple there again the from Mark in the right place. It's the same right as the previous game. Oh, Could this be? Oh, what a tactic. The second what a grapple win. The grapple nearly paid off. The this grapple. Time, the grapple does do the job. So we are close. We are still going here. Can Hampy turn this person around? Mark started weak, has got stronger Oof. and stronger as we've gone on. 
Ooh, but a mistimed time. That jump. was unfortunate. And Hampy is right back in the race. Guys, we have got a race on here. Hampy's taking the lead. Mark's got himself a speed boost, though, and he takes a head. He doesn't go for the grapple on that section, which he has, has worked for him really well, Jim, I thought, so far. Yes, very much. That's definitely a strategy. However... Hampy much better on that turn. However, that turn was really nice, as you said. Hampy fires Ooh. the rocket straight into the environment. So that is done. Maybe he was just getting rid of it so he can get a better pickup. Who knows? Mark has a slight lead here, but this is... What a race. What what a time to be alive. Oh, this is In great. And that's an oh, excellent shot by Mark with the ice. Can that make the difference? Or can Hampy keep this gap close enough? Same We've got spot. 10 seconds before the border explodes. Needs a good turn from Hampy. Not bad. Not bad. He's going for the lower route. He could close this gap up. Here we go, though. This is where things get exciting. Excellent dodging of the boulder by yes. Mark there. Really slow on coming. Excellent work. However, he still needs to close the gap here, Hampy. Wow. Can he do it? Mark, great! And the gap is down wow. now. It's it's so tight. It is so tight. I can't believe what I'm seeing here, guys. Again, another wonderful Ooh. display of speedrunning. Both with an excellent turn. Mark liking yep. that top route. Could that pay off? This could be a bottom yeah. elimination there. No, not quite. Not quite. Oh, Ooh. and the ice gun misses. But Hampy gets the speed boost and he's in the lead now. Guys, we are so close. It's look how so close. look how small the screen is getting. Oh, Hampy hits the environment and hits the crates. This could be fatal. This could be the win for Mark. No, wait. It's not over yet, guys. I can't believe what I'm seeing. Unbelievable race. Now Hampy has brought it forward. Wait. It's not over yet. The big turn coming up. Could this be the important point? It could be. Mark it's taking the last grapple. Mark taking wow. that top route again with the grapple. That worked. Wow. What, Talk, what a race. Man. What a match. Talk about a chicken run. What a match. 3-1 to I Mark. Mean, Mark is through to the next wow. round. Let's bring, Let's bring him that, in. Let's bring honestly, him in. Mark, need to get your immediate reactions from that my friend how do you feel about that battery well um i don't really know how to feel about that one guys the the heart's going at a million miles an hour the hands are sweating hamsh that was well fought my friend well fought my friend it's over wow. to you buddy wow well done classy as ever part-time triggered um yeah. hamsh yeah I saw Mark in that beautiful dress yesterday, and I say, let's go to prom, and that's exactly what we did right here. Yeah. And I'm very happy to dance with him. It was amazing, and uh, I'm very happy that the glass shoe belonged to Mark all along. That was... I mean, Red, Red, I don't know if we've ever had a classier match, classier, more consistent and engaging match than these two competitors. I mean... I'm going bananas for that. Really... Just, just so happy to have seen that. One of the best matches I think we've seen in our in our many, many years of being uh, yeah. casters for this. And uh, I am just yeah, I'm I'm incredibly happy to see this this race and be able to be here and be a part of it. Absolutely, indeed, it's, it was it was super fun. That um, like I never faced Mark in this game, and that we were so equal all the way to the end. It was amazing. It's a, it, Thank it, you, Mark. It's yes. a good mark on your record. Let's let, let's just say that. Thank you, Hampy. That was uh, that was a lot of fun. Okay, <clears throat> guys, you absolutely nailed that. We have one more knockout match before we go to the quarterfinals. So we have Chubbs against Drongo. Now, now, oh. Jim, Drongo, <sighs> yeah, was. Maybe holding it back a bit in the group stage? We'll never know. Yeah, yeah. Uh, it's, I mean, already jumps out to a very split, uh, very split here, actually. You know, I, I would say that Chubbs showing early uh, was not as indicative of his talent and skill in speedrunners as we are going to see in this match against Drongo. And that is nothing against uh, Drongo's talents, which I 
I'm completely unbiased, uh, but Chubbs is going to win. <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean, again, professionals, neutral. Um, Professional. In it of this, we'll play King, and my, my question here is, it could be a battle of the North if it is King against Chubbs. Um, yes. You know, there, there might be a lot of gravy involved. Or do we have King against Drongo? You will remember the, the great Shuey incident of the summer where uh, yeah. King did a Shuey of gravy. And yeah. it had chunks of onion in it. And and I'm not going to lie, Jim. I was aroused. I was as well. It was, mm -hmm. it was. Yeah, seeing. Yeah. Um, yeah, I, 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 I honestly would like to see a shoey off between the it, two yeah. of them. Gravy Maybe versus. Maybe team you know. tournament for the future. Actually. Um, yeah. I think, I think it's very possible. <clears throat> uh, I think so too. Our players are just getting ready. Uh, we're nearly ready for the final of, well, I guess it's round of 16, but not really. Um, but it's before the quarterfinals, so. Yeah, it's the it's the quarter-quarter quarter quarter finals. finals. It's really the eighth finals. Are you offering me an eighth? Uh, if you were to Jim? divide a quarter and a half, I think that quick math. I'll, I'll take an eighth. Thank checks. you, Jim. Yeah. Eighth finals. Yeah, that's 20 years of doing yeah. this. I, again, professionals. 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 Right, they are selecting their runners. We are nearly ready. Um, All it's right. It's Chubbs against Drongo. Do this thing. Again, Omni. Professionals. We know We know what we're talking about. Please. Professionals. Actually, you're red. Uh, okay, I think the players are ready. Uh, okay. Let's get to the gameplay. And All right. it's Chubbs against Drongo. Guys, All right. will we see another epic? I, I hope so. I think it's going to be interesting. I think it's going to be interesting. <laughs> I love you, Omni. All right, guys. We're ready. All right. Red, if... You go on. I will. You want me Absolutely to take this one? Do. This is your game. Great. Great. Back to you, Red. Back to you, Jim. All right. We have the Dapper Butler, of course, in Blade... Uh, well, fellas... What are we having here? Are we having a taunt fest at the beginning? No one even wants to move. The cat is oh, cleaning my itself. Goodness. And the butler, it, we are having some interesting competition here. Um, I I mean, I mean, I, I think that Jim, I think they're going to, and it looks like they're going to start to run now. Okay. They're running in synchronicity that I have not seen in a long time here. But Chubbs out in front, they're starting to turn it on now. The Dapper Butler. Uh, Drongo might have been better off not starting it. But there they go. Another phase through that. More, some more crate blocks. Uh, oh. I, I do think they might have been bantering there a little I bit. Thought, uh, Jim, I thought we were going to have a repeat of the Francisco back in 2014. Oh. I, I also was thinking the same thing, but uh, we just saw Chubbs do a little bit of a taunt, a little self-clean of the cat, a little cat lick uh, there while waiting for Drongo. There's another one. Very interesting strategies here. Uh, these fellas are clearly, uh, they're doing some banting and some taunting. There's a rocket. That's not going to be good for Drongo. As Chubbs pulls quite ahead, we have 30 seconds until... The screen starts to shrink. Drongo now losing it and is... He's still oh, in, Jim! Okay. He is still in! What a slide. Phasing through yet another obstacle. Drongo much improved from... Oh, look at the that, Jim. Oh, another lick uh, by Chubbs. Chubbs getting all the licks in early, uh, but may have... Ooh, froze... Drongo on that one. Uh, you don't want these licks to backfire, though. You want to be able to win. Boom. There it is. Chubbs finishes it off. Dominant. A very, very licky Chubbs. Um, okay, here they go. Again. This time, going to get started a little earlier. I think there's a little bit of teasing and a little bit of, like, showmanship. Perhaps this uh, is you. You get you get really the big seen. you get the big personalities in speedrunners. You get the big dogs. You, really you get do. the A-listers in this, and you can yes, see it. Yes, absolutely. 
absolutely. But uh, yeah, Chubbs just sort of, you know, I, I you'd hate to see this come back and bite him, but the, ooh, Drongo. Oh my goodness. Wow, the ball, the ball play, and Drongo is now gonna not, ooh, well. Yeah. That went wrong. Yeah, that'll do it. Yeah, went high, should've gone low. Classic mistake. Two nil. Two nil. Chubbs ahead. Look at this. More you love to cleaning. see it, Jim. You love to see it. Yeah. The, the truly the cleanest cat we've seen uh, in this speedrunners tournament. To the point where he may have an issue. Oh, look at that grapple. Chubbs loses it by trying that incredibly long grapple. Uh, so it is 2-1. Chubbs over the Aussie. What happened there, Jim? I that was might have been the longest grapple. I mean that was cross screen. What's the hubris? Uh, but Drongo's gonna Throw miss. Away from Drongo. That, oh, a missed grapple hitting the thing, and that is gonna be Chubbs winning that one. What you know, Red? In the twenty years we've been doing this, I have been I have not seen quite a arousing and interesting match such as that. Chubbs has me chubbed. That's for sure. Yes. I agree. Uh, uh, I think we should just maybe we talk to the Chubbs man himself. Chubbs, um, let's talk about your 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 uh, hygiene uh, in that race. Look, we had an agreement before the game. If I had it my way, Drongo would have been licking me. We would have finished at the same time. But there's got to be a winner. Got to be a loser. I mean, you came out of this absolutely clean. Chubbs. So clean. So I never clean. wanted to face Drongo. I didn't oh want to do it to him. I love this man. Yeah. As long as there's no oh shoes my. in sight, it's fine. But yep. Hey. Yep. Wow. Well, that's an incredible performance. Uh, a lot of taunting, but also a lot of respect. And the amount of licking, I don't know if we'll ever see again in oh, a never. tournament. So thank he you for that, He might give Chubbs. you that licking next round. You never know. Oh, I hope you do. I hope you do in more ways than one. Thank you, Chubbs. Uh, let's let's uh, let's talk to the bloody Drongo himself, the Shuey man. Uh, Drongo, what what was uh, what were you feeling during that race? It felt like it was a roller coaster of emotions. Yeah, it really was, Jim. Uh, I went into this round barefoot. Um, I've had some unfortunate logistics uh, problems on my end uh, in the shoe department, um, but uh, you know what? Uh, you know, Chubbs is is an amazing guy, uh, the best guy. And uh, all I can say is I'm smitten with the kitten. Drongo, you are a pleasure. Uh, you you really fought hard there. Um, and I thought you had it. I thought you might have had it. But uh, it, it's always a pleasure to, to talk to you, my friend. And, uh, and uh, you know, you're, you're done. Your, your time is done. But we loved having you. You're a treat. Wow. Wow, red. I, I, my light just, just broke, <laughs> so I had to put a new one in. It might have been Drongo's it was, it was incredible the amount of class. It was the sheer force of, yeah. of Drongo's manliness that, that really yeah, uh, just right. popped my light bulb. <laughs> Literally. Literally popped yes. it for me. Um, but, Literally but popped Jim, your bulb. We now have our quarterfinal lineup and uh i am excited to see this we've got so we've got twiggy versus cave we've got avi versus mm -hmm. noom we've got fraz against wow. mark and we've got king against chubbs what what a lineup what a lineup indeed uh you know i wow i, I think there's those are all going to be very competitive um very competitive quarterfinals, and I I think it's getting harder and harder to to choose now. It's it's, it's um, really exciting. So so by the way, just so you know, guys, the way we're doing this is that we are having this one match, uh, but the final I believe will be best of three, right. um, because we want to see more speedrunners action, as you would expect. Um, mm -hmm. By the way, uh, another reminder. We are running a giveaway for keys for this game, speedrunners. On Twitter, follow the Nook Twitch on Twitter, retweet our tweet about the game, and you will have a chance to win. We will also be giving away some keys for the game later on the stream. 
Uh, might do it before the final, actually. Um, just to just to get the hype going. We'll see how it goes. Thank you, Zelda, for posting that. Um, that is indeed what you heard, KP. We are giving away keys. Thank you very much to Tiny Build for providing us with some keys to give away. And we uh, are pretty sure that this is not going to be the only speedrunners tournament that we do. Um, no, because Red and I have been doing this for 20 yeah, years. Have, yeah, someone uh, asked. We have been doing it for 20 years. We actually started in the, in the classic season of 99-2000. Um, Brilliant year. Y2K was happening then, and we didn't know what speedrunners was going to be. I, it was when Barry speedrunner Jenkins was at the, the height of his career. Um, oh, Barry. Just just great stuff to watch. But we are really... Rest in peace. Rest in peace, Barry. Yeah, um, a horrible accident once again. But uh, we are seeing some some of them getting up to this level. Yeah. Um, it's... Uh, Indeed. It's... Oh, honestly. I'm excited. Uh, we are nearly ready for our first quarter final. Very excited. Twiggy versus Cave. Uh, I am... I can't call this one, Jim. I don't know who's who's going to take this. I am I am looking forward yeah. to a really good race. Me too. I I think Cave is going to show Twiggy some surprises in this one. Uh, I I do think that Twiggy is going to ultimately take it, but I think I think Cave is going to give Cave, Twiggy a massive run for her. Cave money. really ran King close in the group stage, and and there yep. were a lot of, there was a lot of chat that that King was going to win that group easily, but Cave has shown us. What can happen when you have that underdog yeah. tag? Um, so so yeah. I'm really looking forward to it. Um, so let's get the game. Will Twiggy, will Twiggy just absolutely crumble under the pressure? It, it could be happening. This, this, could yeah. this be a repeat of the Hampy Mark match? Because honestly, that Hampy Mark match is going to go down in the annals of history. Absolutely. No question. Absolute annals of history. The annals of history. So when our players are ready, they're going to kick the game off. And uh, we are... Really looking forward to this. Let's, yeah, I, 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 I'm, I'm absolutely giddy with excitement. Okay, I, uh, I'll take this one then, Jim. Go. We've got here we go. The witch. We've got the shark. Back to you, Red. Back to you, Jim. Back to you, Thank you, Red. Jim. We have got Twiggy in the lead on the broom. We've actually got an orca whale in the background at the castle. This is some sort of underground, underwater. Atlantis style thing, but now we're out of the water. This is very interesting. And there's a toilet because of course there is. We've got Twiggy on top. Yeah. Cave bringing it back early though. Look at that run. Didn't quite press the advantage. It's it's almost as if this is half caves because of the shark Hello there. and half Twiggy. This is absolutely perfect. This is what what a, what an ideal race we've got going on here. Uh, Simplicity, I'm afraid this is just our uh, our stream team, the Nook. We're all fighting against each other, um, but thank you for joining us. Um, we have got Twiggy against Cave, and this this is quite a race. That little explodey blow up thing once again. Uh oh. The explodey uh -oh. blow up thing has had an effect, but Twiggy has stayed in the game, avoids that blow up thing, and we almost taste the rainbow there. Um, but it oh. was so close. Not hashtag not ad. Hashtag not an ad. Um, we're gonna skittle past that one. And we've got yeah. shark woman. <laughs> shark woman firing the ice, oh, but not please. quite getting it. We've got Twiggy hitting the crates and Cave taking the lead. This is gonna be a long race. I can this see is, it. The, we are approaching the witching hour. Absolutely. In this race. I can't believe they, uh, my, my jaws are clenched. Uh, but there you go. Oh, it's a, not the only thing that's clenched, Red. It's, not the only thing. It was thing. a win for Cave. That was a fantastic race, though, and this one is far from over. Twiggy taking an early lead as Cave hits some of the crates. Twiggy getting the pickup with the lovely Ooh, grapple there grapple. she's got that one down but then slows down allows cave to come back to it but look at the grappling from wow. twiggy that is pro level and she was so far Ooh. ahead the ice gun didn't even hit her what a play by twiggy it's one one jim we, we've got one. an epic we've got an epic on our hands here this is oh. this is toit indeed uh mm. as toit as it comes 
Unbelievable. Will the rocket hit? The rocket does hit, but Twiggy doesn't lose out too much. These two are yeah. neck and neck. Broom and jaw. It is so tight. What a fantastic Wow. Display. Hat and fin above the Absolutely, rest. Absolutely, Jim. You couldn't have put it better. I couldn't have put it better myself. We're in the jungle section now. Swinging on those vines. Oh, could K fall down? That's really oh, helped there. Play. The shortcut brings it back level. Twig gets the crates. These two are neck and neck once again. What a race we are witnessing here, my friends. Oh, my wow. goodness. Okay, we've got Cave taking the lead. Twiggy losing some of her early grappling ability. It's not quite working out for her. And this could be the end of the game. It is. It is. Cave 2 1. What a fantastic race once again. It's 2 wow. 1 to Cave. Back to you, Red. It's 2 1. Back to you, Jim. Back to Thank you, Red. Jim. We are back in the race. This is very intense. I'm really enjoying this race. Guys. Twiggy with the uh, ice fart there, the, the, the backward ice blast. Didn't yeah. quite work. The ice fart does work sometimes, but not on that occasion. And Cave firing Ooh, it forwards this time. time. Can't quite get it involved. Can Twiggy force a final match? Or is it going to be Cave to take it 3-1? This is really close, though. Twiggy is streaking ahead now. Can she sweep it? She can't. It's neck and neck once again this is why i got into this sport i yeah, just absolutely. i i am loving what i'm seeing the shark is flopping around beautifully we've got grapples we've got action we've wow. got boosts we have got a neck and neck race going on here slight mistake it's by twiggy cam k oh, press advantage i think she will. it's a victory it's a victory wow. for k what a race cave Mobs that section that section twiggy nailed it once and i think she it got into her head she couldn't do it again the sleeper pick wow. what an incredible um incredible race and it's cave wow to the semi-finals gg what a fantastic who do we, we talk race. to first I think we need to talk to our winner cave yeah uh, you're in the last four how how do you feel about that I I have trouble breathing. <laughs> wow. Cave, that was well intense. done. Intense. I did Very not intense. expect to win. That there, was honestly. an incredible race, Cave. Um, did you have a, a, a tactic or just you know? I, I was just you know breathe, try to breathe, and just go with it, and it it worked. Apparently. Breathing is is a key component of uh, speedrun play. We we all know this. Um, and especially Red and I. Yeah. Know this as we are professional. Twenty years. Professionals. Yeah, professionals so yeah congratulations cave twiggy that section that section hit you hard uh, in in the end wow what what are your emotions i thought that was fantastic played by uh by cave that section right there is a 50 50 chance either i make it or i die yeah yeah <laughs> you know uh, you know twiggy uh, one you know one could say that this could have been listed as sort of a choke. Um, and how do you feel about that? I think that there was no choke. There was mm. no choke. Cave did fantastically, and she earned the victory. In, in Got unrelated it. news, uh, Jim has just been banned from the Nook. Hello there. Um, Wait, oh, me, I didn't get that. After, <laughs> the, uh, after the tournament. Did I get that message? <laughs> Excellent. Uh, Thank you so much well, for all the Twiggy, follows, guys. Well done. Well done. Um, it was that was really an epic, an epic battle between the two of you. And uh, yes, the, all the, right. The, the, wow, the friendships are being tested. Um, yeah, it's yeah, it's an emotional time for us all. But uh, Cave is through to the semifinals, and now we have got this is this is a big one, Jim. This. This yeah. is a big one. We've also got a big race going on. Um, Avi against you, Noom. You, you know, Avi is a, 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 a... I would say Avi might be a favorite in this one, but again, Noom is a dark horse, very much like Cave. And so we just saw Twiggy go down as the favorite. So 
there's you know there's some potentials uh, for for Noom to, to if he's got some good strats that he could take anything this. anything can happen in speedrunners it is Absolutely. brutal um you know lives lives get lost um lives get lost yeah yeah it's it's, it's yes. it, it takes prisoners so we've got Abby against Noom coming up uh you know what, Red, I think we're starting to see now is sort of the psychological effects that this game has, right? It's very athletic. Speedrunning is very athletic, um, obviously, right? It's running. But I think the psychology of play is really going to start to come into focus now. I um, I can't wait to see what we've got in store. Um, yeah. Will we see some, some moves we've never seen before? Uh, it's possible. Uh, in 20 years... Something always surprises us. You never know. Yeah. You never know. Um, so shall we? Let the avocados roll, in... as they say. Exactly. Exactly. Um, shall we do this? Back to you, back Red. Back to you, Jim. Thank you. Back to you. Thank you. All right. Are we going to go here? We are, we are ready for action, guys. Good luck to our competitors. Good luck to both. Back to you, Jim. Back to you, Red. Thank you. Back to me, Jim. All right. The Jailbird and the Cat are off. Avi out front, even with the handcuffs. She's going to have to steal herself a victory, I think, today in order to beat Noom because Noom has a lot of talent in speedrunners. Here he is ahead. Ooh, a quick grapple there on the turn by Avi. That was not a coincidence. That was oh. intentional. And the rocket play. Oh my goodness. Wow. Noom surviving that rocket play, but Avi with the strategies there to try to take Noom out early did not work. Uh, wow. Now a speed boost, but hitting all three of those boxes, but Noom cannot handle it oh my that was an goodness. up and down match it may not have looked close but it really was it was very very close here comes avi now out in front in the second efforts here noom right behind Ooh, noom got caught up a little bit there not sure what that was about but handling the grappling very well missing all of the boxes here's the big turn oh the crates avi hitting those Closing the gap here. Ooh, almost missed that, but Noom was ready for it. This is a potential dangerous turn there. Avi trying to use the rocket once again. Does not work. Although, oh, oh Noom! It all went wrong for Noom at the end there. On the crates, Avi goes up 2 nothing here as we enter the third of four races. Wow. Uh, honestly, Jim, uh, we are seeing some excellent play here. Noom is against a really Noom fierce is... competitor here. He, he is not a playing very bad here, but he's two down. Yes. Yes. Noom, Noom is a very, very fantastic ad speedrunners. Uh, Avi, though, is, is just real. Oh, look at that long, almost entirely stretching these, the span of the screen grapple, trying to get that butt. But uh was was not to be. Avi still holds on to the lead. There's another one. Noom just trying for anything at this point to take Avi out. Noom is using the grapple but... well, but it's not quite paying off. He's not getting it in the right spots and he's not taking advantage no. and taking the lead. He's just no. staying in the game. It's a bit of a crapple. A little bit. Slide. Nice. Avi hitting all of those slides really, really well. Oh boy, here on on the vertical. And ooh, Noom sliding through that. That helped save him, but Avi with Big oh, ice hit the ice block. Wow. wow. And the boulder, the flaming boulder, does not land. Wow, this is oh, the oh no, Noom hitting those boxes. Trying to save it with the grapple. Avi though, quick turns. Noom staying ahead. We have 30 seconds until the course starts to shrink. Noom tries to hit it with a frozy freeze freeze. Mr. Freeze gun does not hit it. That is the official <laughs> yeah, term yeah. for it. Yep. 
This is a long game there, Jim. I am very, wow. very impressed with Noom's they longevity here. Absolutely getting exhausted. He does hit her with a boulder, which does close the gap. Oh my goodness gracious. Amazing scenes. Wow. And there it goes. We are starting to close the screen in. They are now closer than ever because they know that it, they need to be as this shifts and gets smaller and smaller. One mistake here. Wow. And that's it, Jim. Yes, absolutely. Noom hitting that crate, but Avi also hitting the crate, saving Noom. That could have been it, but it was not to be. Noom taking the high ground. Avi taking the low ground. That could be. That's a huge win, a for, win Noom. for Noom. Noomy goes up 2 1 as we head into the fourth. Can Noom tie this thing up? What a play, Jim. What a play. Take the wow. Top route and just yes. shooting it down. Avi was not ready for that one, and uh, it worked out in Noom's favor. Quick grapple early on there by Avi, trying to just finish this thing off. A backwards Freezy McFreeze gun oh. by Noom. Noom hitting all of those crates, could not capitalize on Avi. Oh, oh no, it's all and wrong then for Noom. missing, dropping crates, and it's Avi. Oh, what a victory by Avi, the avocado win it. I can't believe what I saw, but the avocado Unbelievable. smashed it there. The avocado, indeed, indeed. Uh, she made absolute guacamole. Do you know, of uh, Jim, Noom. that on average, 53 yeah. and a half million pounds of guacamole are eaten every Super Bowl Sunday? I, you know what? I may have heard that before, but I appreciate the update, updated statistics. It's, it's on also. That. Uh, Funnily enough, uh, it's actually 60 million on the infamous Speedrunners Sunday. So, you know, they, they've got some sure, catching up sure. to do, but at least, you know, at least they try. Yep. No, nope, that's fine. And we've called many championships of the Speedrunners. So we know that that many people are, are watching. So, uh, I mean, we have 133 million watching yeah, right yeah. now. So, uh, you know, pretty clear. Uh, well, let's uh, let's start with with our, our winner here, Avi. Um, Avi, what were you feeling after Noom? got that victory uh, in the third round there. I was definitely given a run for my money there. I was concerned. I was very stressed, but I did feel generally fairly confident. So it, it felt all right. Was, and I have to ask relieved. you, I have to ask you, was that an intentional early grapple on those, those vertical shifts to maybe knock Noom out very early on? Uh, I gotta say, I, uh, there were so many grapples. I do not remember any individual grapples. It's I just, excellent. I was That's trying the to answer grab the we were looking for. At any point, I could, yeah. and sometimes I did it, sometimes I didn't, you know. Spectacular. I mean, I don't know if we're gonna get a better answer than that. We're all professionals, professionals. here. Can we, uh, congratulations, Abby, on moving on. Let's, uh, let's talk to Noom. That was, uh, Noom, that was a rough one. That was, uh, you, you, it looked like you had it there, and then... Boy, what was going through your head in that fourth race? Well, obviously, pretty disappointed with the mistakes there, Jim. We uh, we wanted to make the the guacamole, but we just didn't have the ingredients, so we've come home empty-handed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, and and uh, you you fought valiantly though, Noom. I, I really thought that you might have been able to tie it up there, but uh, Avi really pushed hard in that last race and uh, was not to be. But congratulations, yeah. Noom. You did well, and we loved having you. Thank you, Noom. Thanks, Jim. It's, it's been a pleasure. Jim. Oh, my, what a rough that one. Was, that was rough. I'm, I'm a bit emotional. I'm Me a bit too. emotional. But Me too. We have got another absolute belter of a match. And it's something we haven't seen for about 13 years. We've got a cock off, Jim. We have a cock off. We have off. a cock off. Wow. Yeah. This is this yeah, is big. It's been at least thirteen years. We've got a, yeah. Uh, uh, it's great to see. Um, we've got Fraz against Mark, and yeah. uh, they are both the Falcon. Yeah, I believe our last cock off was between Tiny Tim and Fancy That's Pete. That's right. And back in yeah, oh six, oh seven yeah, season. Yeah, oh, that was a that was a classic game, but um, it was. There was. Also, rest there in was, peace. There was too much. Rest yeah, in rest in peace. Again, horrible accident. Um, 
but uh, just the, the cock jousting that we saw yeah. was was incredible. But they definitely cross swords yeah. too too much. Um, let's hope it doesn't happen yeah. today. Man, I you know this one again. You you kind of need to give the edge to Fraz. I think I think we've got to we've got to say that. However, so the the red cock is Fraz. The white cock is Mark, and. Okay. This is brutal already. Look at the speed of Fraz. That is one quick cock. I am very impressed That's at the speed of the cock. Uh, however, Mark is very much in this game. He is keeping in touch. Is that rocket going to have an effect? No, it doesn't. And in fact, Mark has taken the lead. This is incredible. Wow. What a race we've got going on here. The uh, the rare cock off is, is something to behold, guys. So I hope you are realizing how privileged you are to be seeing this right now we are professionals professionals um, absolute professionals yeah. uh, back to you back red to you, jim thank you red back thank you, to you jim back to me we have fraz really pushing hard but mark is somehow still staying in touch wow yes yes this is this is an incredible race that we've got going on a mistake by mark though that could be a big problem that could be a problem here jim we may see the end of the game shortly. However, Mark is somehow staying in touch. This is incredible. A mistake at the end Rats. there, though. Somehow Mark oh. is still not out of this game. But what an absolute dominant leading wow. display. Uh, Mark really did well there to keep in. Yes, he did. I'm very impressed. But Fraz is 1-0 up. We are already Fraz underway. Fraz just he flapped harder. Yeah. You know? Yeah, absolutely. Um, he's got years of experience um of cocking yes. and um it shows but the ice block wow the ice block from mark couldn't that have an effect for him can he draw level it's one nil we're still in the early stages of this match we're in the quarterfinals of the nook speedrunners team tournament who is going to take the crown who is going to be the chief speedrunner the block on the grapple that wow. is pro stuff there. But he doesn't block the second one. That's excellent play by Mark. This is great to watch, Jim. What a race we've got going on here. If Fraz thought he was going to have beak. it... If Fraz thought he was going to have it easy, well, he knows he's in a game now. Yes. Wow. Um, absolutely wonderful to watch. The, the double grapple, again, not something you see very often, but it's wow. beautiful. Fraz, though, it's very smooth on those grapples. He Ooh. makes a mistake, Ooh. though. Trying to go for the top round. Both missing with their blowy up thing. And Mark takes it. It's 1-1. One, wow. one. It's 1-1, one, one, Jim. Unbelievable. What a game. What a game we have got going on here. Could we see a real upset here? I don't know. This mm. is speedrunners at its finest. We have got two Absolutely. great competitors here. Mark, the underdog. Many would say, because especially because of the early ping problems. And he's blown Ooh. Fraz up. Could this be a big wow. deal? I think we saw a bit of lag issue there for uh, for Mark. But he's holding on. What a cock. The hope of block. Australia, as Drongo very much uh, points yeah, out. But that right. is a good... And, and Numa out, yeah. too. That is a good use of the rocket by Fraz. But Mark has kept he's it in. He's too flying the coop right this... now. Absolutely. Uh... They're egg and egg. Um, just, it's so close. I, I can't yeah, believe it. Yeah, it is. It, you know, speedrunners is no yoke. It's it's a really... Correct. You know, it's a cracking game. Um, I shall not make fun of any of these competitors. But that is an excellent, excellent wow. use of wow. the ice. Excellent use wow. of the ice. And it's 2-1 of Fraz. We have got... Absolutely. Mark now has to win no. this one to force it to a final round. But that's a good boulder by Fraz. And he's taken an early lead. And that is brilliant stuff. Mark really keeping in the game. This is just liquid speedrunners. I am enjoying this so much. It's a good job. My camera cuts off at the yeah. chest. That's all I'll say, Jim. Oh, yes, absolutely. I could not agree with you more as these cocks battle that. and that is going to do it it's come wow. home to roost jim it's all over fraz yes, it has fraz takes it what a fantastic race oh mark what a tough egg to lay though i mean it's that's a tough one that's a that's a tough egg to swallow
it always is. Um, yeah. You know, I, uh, I'm very proud of both of them. That was... GG's. That was some solid speed running. Um, okay, wow. Uh, I, think, I think we need to talk to our winner here. Um, absolutely. He's been, he's been strong. Fraz, you are in the semi-finals. Congratulations. How, how, Thank what you are your emotions right now? I have right now, uh, my emotions are off the charts. Um, I would like to rename myself the Aussie Slayer, if it's okay. I've uh, managed to take uh, down two so far. It's a shame that Bloody Drongo didn't make it this far, because I uh, would have liked to make this clean sweep. But you wow. know what? I'll take what I can. Yeah. Fair, fair wow. enough. Um, I mean... Talk us through that match. It was it was close, and, and Fra uh, Mark took one off you there. Were you, were you worried when it got to 1-1? Uh, you know what? When he grabbed my cock, I was a little bit worried. But, um, well, there was some tussling going on. But uh, I think, you know, I came out on top. Absolutely. Yeah. Um, and, you and really did. As, as we always know, Fraz loves to come first. Uh, so congratulations yeah. to you. You are in the semifinals. Congratulations. We will see you. Top cock. Indeed. To Fraz. Indeed. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you. Uh, Mark, you had a slow start to this tournament, but you really pushed it all the way there. Um, how, how are you feeling? Feeling pretty, uh, pretty good after that one. I mean, uh, you know, I did uh, grab his hard, tried to grab his hard cock at that stage, and unfortunately, yeah. I just couldn't really pull it back, and yeah. he exploded towards the end there and just came first. That was, uh, yeah, it was a, uh, it was a hard shot to take, um, but mm. you know, sometimes mm. you just gotta, you just gotta swallow that, and um, uh, you did it well. You, you you took it like a champ. Yeah, yeah. Sometimes you just gotta. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I couldn't hold it in. Sorry. <laughs> We're professionals. professionals. We're all professionals. Yeah. But when when it's cock v cock, it, it's all about who who manages to you know get across the finish line first. And yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Fresh showed again that um, he's no two pump chump. <laughs> that's that's Thanks. absolutely what a brilliant um analogy um mm. thank you thank you for providing us our first <laughs> cock off for many years we we uh Hello, we that, enjoy that more so thank you to you both congratulations to fraz he's in the semi-finals and jim he's gonna play one of the northerners one of the northerners yeah it's uh yeah. it's king versus chubbs uh i mean this is the I I we've had some pretty tight races, but I think this is the toughest one yet to call. It's it is going to be an interesting one because I, you know what I would agree with you, Red. I I don't even know if I was to vote. Uh, I mean, and and look, chat chat also agrees. Look at that split. That is eight, yeah eight nine nine. Uh, you know, it was tough because King showed a lot uh, in the quarter, or I'm sorry, in the group. Uh, stages, but it was tough because we weren't able to see everything because he did have the handicap suit. That is true. Right? So uh, it's going to be interesting to see uh, who's going to be able to uh, to come out on this one. Lexi's here. Hello. Um, hey, Lexi. We, yeah, we've got, we've got a north off. Uh, I'm sure there's going to be some some serious talk going on here but i think it'll all be gravy in the end um i think so, yeah. Think so. Yeah. yeah i agree i agree so we are nearly ready to get going um interesting choice by king argroth sherlock we have got, yeah let's get that up on the stream right now we have got we have got the kitty cat against sherlock bones um i mean this this game is elementary, um, but it, yes. it, it, I'll be interested to see whether it uh, whether it pays off. We've got cat versus dog, the ultimate yes. the ultimate show. Uh, where yeah. do you stand? Uh, 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 it looks like Chips has taken the the poll, but it's very close. It's very close. Jim. Really close. I mean, the closest one yet potentially, um, uh, if I remember correctly. But um, I. Uh, do you want me to handle this Absolutely, one? Absolutely, Jim. This is Red? totally... T Great. So back uh, to you then, yeah, Red. Yeah, thank you, Jim. Back to you. All right. Back to me. Um, that was 
as we get ready here, let's there do this one thing. vote in it in the poll. One vote. One vote. 51-49. And King has it, but we'll see here. That does not actually count, King. You still need to race. Still need to race. Uh, the excitement is palpable. It is. I kitten wait. I know what you mean, dog. Okay, and cat and dog are off. We're gonna see who is the supreme pet species. We can't pussyfoot around this one, Jim. We cannot. Oh, this one will go to the dogs. King out early. Looks like we're having some lag issues here. Um, but there's a grapple by King trying to pull Chubbs back to his position. Uh, Wow. This is very, very close at this point. I cannot, I cannot guess who's really going to win this one. really holding his own here. I cannot guess who's going to win this one. I, I know. It's, it's, very, uh, it's very rough to call. This is, this is some pro stuff here, guys. What a... It really what? is. I mean, they're doing so well. Uh, obviously, honestly, a lot of obstacles avoiding too. They're they're just really handling handling this course. Yeah, we got a bit. Of, we got uh, a bit of lag. Sorry about that, guys. It's uh, Discord is, yeah. is having some chug. Wow. Um, okay, Chubb's stopping there to try to to slow down King, but that seemed to backfire. Chubb's hitting up all those crates. Goodness this gracious. Is, this this uh, is one of the uh, the hardest uh, maps, I would say. I'm, I mean, it almost looks like the same person is playing both. Uh, they're they're mirroring each it's other. Like a, it's like a beautiful uh, ballet, isn't it, Jim? It's like a ballet. It is. It's 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 incredible. I mean, it, it, it's and there's a little bit of a grapple there by King to take over the lead, but but Chubbs is still holding on. Again, avoiding all these obstacles, taking some speed boosts as they head up the vertical shaft. Nice, excellent shaft Chubbs work. Trying the excellent shaft work. Shaft work is excellent. They're trying the backwards freezy gun. Does not work. Ooh, this could be bad. We have a gap. But Chubbs saves it. This is epic, wow. Jim. I I don't want to bark up any trees here. But I don't know what's going to happen. Although, wait a minute. Ki oh, no. King could have had a chance. That wow. Was, that oh. was a bit poor. King almost eliminated himself, I think. Which he's done. He did do in the, in the previous races, by the way. So we got to look out for that. Potential problems there. As they head up the next shaft here. Chubs. What a boost. Getting eliminated at the very end. That was a race. Wow. That was only race one, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, let want to be clear about that. I can't. The, I, I'm the second. I'm not gonna lie, Jim. My blood pressure is pretty high yeah. right now. I I agree with you. I uh, I don't even know how how to really uh, to feel about about this. But Chubb's taking a very early lead. King's gonna have to catch back up because he is really speeding by here. Really trying to eliminate King earlier as to as to not have to play such a long match. Uh, wants to get the elim very early. Uh, Chubbs is pushing it very hard, but King oh, is grapple. not laying off that big grapple there by Chubbs. There's the rocket by King. No, just hitting the decks. Wow, they both handle that vertical... Uh, so they, well. They're, they're very used to handling the shafts. They are indeed. I can't believe what I'm okay, seeing. Okay, Chubbs out in front. Good slides, good avoiding of the crates. As they head back down, King holds Chubbs in his sight here. This is this wow. is so tense. It's really something special to this watch. This is a strong... Uh, Jim, this, this side of the draw is strong. He, winner of this I, I winner agree. of this plays Fraz in the semi-final. 
Okay, huge. This is this should make Fraz uncomfortable if I was him. Oh, Chubb's struggling a little bit with that, but gets through it. But if I'm Fraz watching this, I mean, you have some serious competition. Chubb's has improved dramatically over the, even just this competition that we've seen here. That's a oh, a really smart rocket there by King, but it doesn't do too much. King just cannot shake Chubbs off of his back. Goodness gracious. King getting stopped up a little bit, but so does Chubbs. When they when one makes a mistake, the other does as well. It's really... Oh, getting knocked by the boulder. This is neck and neck, Jim. I can't call the winner of this. Wow. I, I mean, look at this. It's magnificent. There's another rocket. Does not get it. King tried to get the rocket, but it backfired and he was not able to do it. It is 1-1, one, one, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, that has only been the second race. There are two more. Early rocket exploded seemingly both of them. Wow. Oh, what an epic I mean, turn. Ooh, a missed grapple there by King, but he catches back up because Chubbs could not capitalize. Oh, now King takes it back over. Chubbs looks like he's slowing down a little bit. I don't know what that's about, but... Ooh, King hitting that obstacle. There's Chubbs with the speed boost trying to take advantage. King having a little bit of struggles there as he gets eliminated early. Okay, so Chubbs, it is 2-1. Here we come into the final race. 1-0 one down. 1-0 one down to 2-1 up. This is this is huge. Wow. This is huge, What Jim. a comeback. What a cat, cat back. I think you were barking up the wrong bush with that one. I absolutely. Back to you, Back Red. To you, Jim. Thank you, Red. And Chubbs now, way behind. Uh, King knows he needs this. And Chubbs, oh, just some sloppy play, missing the grapple. They're having a decider. Two, We've got a decider. It is two all. This is it. We have not had. A 2-2 race before, ladies and gentlemen. That you are witnessing history here today. Cats versus dogs. There is so we thought the so... cockoff was good. This is, I mean, this is absolutely incredible. There is so litter between them, Jim. So litter between them. Agreed. No bones about it. Wow. Okay. It is tied up. Who is going to have the advantage? Who's going to be able to get through this? Just, I mean, they have got to be exhausted at this point. That is a lot of racing. Their dogs must be barking. Here they go. Oh, oh my goodness. Almost missing that grapple, but then saves and it. There's a freeze gun. The ice missed. Oh, my goodness. Wow. Wow. Chubbs trying to close it out. Chubbs. No, but King is not going to give up that. He's done easily. it. Big turn and Chubbs done takes it. it on the vertical. King. Wow. He's beaten by the height once again. King Argaroth loses to the height. The champ. The champ. I think we all have some chubs after that. Wow. Race. I mean. Wow. wow. Uh, let's 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 bring him in. Let, let's let's let, we got to bring him in. Chubs. Uh, your heart must be your heart must be pounding. It's time for some catnip. Oh, I can't breathe. Oh, oh my. I'm lie down and then goodness. Find the next. What a match, Chubs. Ooh. What a match, buddy. That you came down two one. You were no, you were down zero one, and you came back and won this thing. What a I'm battle! So much. Wow! The what a king battle! Of the so the wow. king, uh, king had a good go of that. I never beat King in practices, by the way. I never beat him. And the cat got the cream. Wow! Oh yeah. The yes. cat got the cream, and the dog goes back to the doghouse. Wow! Uh, well, congratulations, Chubbs. You're gonna face Fraz. Yep. In the finals or the semifinals, excuse me. Plan. Oh I boy, Abby in the finals. I called it. <laughs> yes, you Remember. did. And now you're here, Chubbs. I mean, 
talk about strategy. I mean, well done, sir. Well done. By by King scores, he's winning. Yeah, let's not forget he uh, he does his own scores. Right, King does rig his own scores, but let's let's bring him in. Uh, King, uh, boy, that was uh, brutal. I mean, you, you seemed like you had Chubbs early, and he just came roaring back, or I guess meowing back. Honestly, Jim, I eliminated myself there. Yeah, you did. Uh, you were. I, I jumped. The yep. the first time I jumped, I should have learned from it, and I didn't. You were, you were, yeah, it, the, the struggle, you know, we were concerned that the struggle with some of that, the height was going to come back to bite you, um, or, you know, and it did. I mean, I mean, at the, at the end of the day, I can't be too mad. I eliminated no. the best player myself just then. Wow. So, okay. Still with the confidence. I like it. It's interesting. I, like it. Uh, I, d I don't, you know, this tournament doesn't change anything. I know I beat Chubbs all the time in yeah. casual play, so. Okay, you know, it's, it's, it's all about the heart. I, 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 okay. beat, I beat Chubbs almost every night. Wow. Um, Couldn't beat him off just now, but you know. Couldn't beat him there, though. Yeah. Well, in, a, yeah. in a tournament, in a, in a tournament like situation, it just looks like Chubbs, Chubbs were all over me. Yeah. You know? Yeah. 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 Well, you know, uh, in a time where it counted, uh, he couldn't come through. So. Uh, King, congratulations! Better luck next time, buddy. And uh, thanks for playing with us. It's been a, it's been an I absolute pleasure. Should have my handicap suit, shouldn't I? Should have. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, wow, Jim. Wow. Jim, okay. We have yeah. we have our last four. Okay. We have the semifinals. We have Cave against Avi. We have Fraz. Wow. Against Chubbs. What a lineup! I am so excited to see where this goes. However. I think uh, I think a break is in order before we get to the semifinals and the final. So um, we'll, sure. have a, we'll have a little break. And uh, the guys can vote on who they think is going to win. But I think uh, yeah. we need some peas. We need some teas. We need some beers. We need whatever you need. Absolutely. Guys, I will uh, put us on the BRB screen. And Jim and I will return shortly as we enter the last four guys this is gonna be this is gonna be good see you in a few minutes
Welcome back. Oh boy. Wow. What a... Hang on. I can't hear Jim. There we go. Jim! Hello, Red! Hello, Red. back. Welcome back, my friend. We are back. How... Back to you. How are you doing, man? Good. I'm feeling extra professional. Uh, always. Always professional. Uh, that yeah. is the, the name of the of the game uh apart from when it's uh name speedrunners it. um it's Indeed. absolutely the name we're down to the last four this is very exciting uh before we get to the semi-finals we are going to be having a giveaway of some keys for this game before the final so make sure you uh Excellent. make sure you stick around for that i mean you're obviously going to want to watch the final anyway uh, but there is yeah. also a giveaway currently going on on Twitter as well for keys. Thank you very much to Tiny Build, the devs of Speedrunners, for providing them. Uh, so if you follow us on Twitter and also retweet that tweet, you are in with a chance of winning. Uh, but we will also run a giveaway here in chat. We've got lots of keys to give away, so you have a very good chance. And as you have seen, it's the ultimate sport. So... Uh, you know true professionalism ab absolutely at its um i think there's no there's no question that we are seeing some of the best speedrunners i think in our 20 years jim this has been it's 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 at least in the top 17 i think it's definitely in the top 17 i was going to say th this decade has been it's been pretty good um but the previous decade was it's hard mm. to beat but we're getting close we're getting close absolutely absolutely so. okay we have our first semi final uh, we have Avi against Cave. So Cave has already seen off Tubex. She's seen off Twiggy. Yep. Yeah. I, I I mean, can can she beat the Jailbird? I mean, can, can Cave? Are we gonna get? You know, are we gonna get the two favorites in the final, or is something gonna happen? I I have been very impressed with Cave's technique. Uh, top techers, yeah. as I believe they say. Absolutely, that's industry. Um, yeah, I mean, <clears throat> what what what's gonna happen? What what has Cave got to do to win this? I think you know, Avi doesn't make a lot of mistakes, but Cave has been very consistent. So I I think that for Cave to win this, uh, she needs to continue to maintain that consistency and very little mistakes, uh, and wait for Avi to slip up. And because it's possible, we've seen it before. Uh, which she's just going to need another one of those Hello now. There. So a lot of focus, a lot of focus going to need for this one. I I, I agree. Um, I am yeah really excited for this. Um, I think it's going to be a huge match. So again, yes. finals, one match, uh, and then the final will be best of three. Oh boy. Okay, let's get let's get ready. Let's get ready. Here we let's go. Let's do it. We have got <clears throat> Jailbird against the Shark, Avi against Cave. The avocado against the mobster. We, it's it's yep. it's like um, West Side Story all over again. It really is um, true words. Some audio here. I have good. Okay, guys. I can't wait for this. Um, do you want to call this one, Jim, or shall I? Uh, back to Thank you, Red. You, Jim, back to you back to me. Yeah, yeah. Back to. Uh, wait, what? Yes, back to you, Red. Back, back to, to you. you. Back to me. You Thank read. you, Jim. Right. You're welcome. Okay, Good we team. are underway. We're on the metro level. Welcome to New Rush City. We have got the jailbird against the shark. It's uh, it's the classic uh, romantic story. Uh, it is. Criminal meets shark. Shark eats criminal. Then throws it back up again, and they become friends. And we've got Abby in Correct. the early lead. Abby is in the early lead. And the... Oh, that was a nasty crate on Cave. Cave has got some work to do here to stay in this match. Ooh. Can she keep it going? She's been hit off. And it's a quick win. It's a quick win for Avi. But that wow. was... That was... A lot of things conspired wow, against a... Cave there. I don't think this, this is going to be that simple. Cave was unlucky there. But that was very, very professional from Abby. She is clinical in her job. But that is an excellent... Excellent rocket from Cave, but then she messes up the grapple and gives Avi the lead once again. This is this is so close. Uh, Avi once again taking the lead. Can she? She's dodged the grapple. That is excellent dodging. The Cave 
Shark not hit, not doing well, hitting the crates, and Avi oh. takes a 2 0 lead. This is, as Jimmy says, this is ruthless so far. Cave is mm. an excellent player, an excellent player, but we are seeing some really top level stuff. Avi has got better and better as the tournament has gone on. She's the one to beat, Jim. She is, and and Cave is honestly making more mistakes uh, than than we 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 can see here. Uh, she's not going to be able to win it it's, that way. It's, it's the uh, look at the crate drops by Abby. She's just nailing everything. Yeah, it's, it's like a perfect really... a perfect dance. It's just beautiful it's to watch. Honestly, I, I feel <clears throat> bad for the competitors, but when you see someone at the top of their game like this executing to perfection, wait a minute. Well done. Wait a minute. Cave getting the ice shot in there. And back in the room. It backfired on Abby. They both froze. Oh, oh. but Cave oh, messes no. up the grapple. That could be a big problem as we go on top level. Can Cave keep this one going? It's 2-0 to Abby. One more. And Abby is in the final. Our first finalist. But that is an excellent grapple by Cave. Wow. Suddenly, we are back in business. But, oh, no. It wrong again, and the crate from Avi again. She nailed the crates really well, but there are some playing by Cave. Unfortunate hitting of crates, but we're still in business. We've got a vertical section coming up. She dodges the grapple once again on that section. That happened twice. Yeah, see, and it's looking we're, we're fatal. Seeing, oh, oh, lots of crackling. We were seeing. You know what? I will. Uh, we were seeing too much there. Uh, I think Cave started to feel a little bit of that panic and was going for the grapples, but was hitting the, was hitting some of the crates and things. And uh, wow, wow, what a what a what a, what a performance, what a performance though by Abby. I'll have to do a quick disconnect because it seems to happen. Well done. Well done. Uh, let's let's talk to uh okay, back, sorry let's talk to our winner uh, let's talk to abby. abby congratulations you're in the final oh, hello. you're in I the am. finals it's my worst fear that was i was wow. afraid this would that happen. was <laughs> my nightmare clinical perfect three three nil clinical it was it my was. dream last night i dreamed it last yeah. night it was a it was a nightmare uh fraz was stomping on a lot of avocados and, oh. and throwing them off a cliff and and then and then I'm sorry. Do you it need was a moment, awful. Abby? And and here we are. It's becoming reality. Wow. Well, way to, way to be strong through that. I uh, I would. You know what though, Abby? I would say that Frash should be quivering in his boots. Uh, Cave after that did performance. did a great job. I. Uh, she a did. Good game, Cave. Thank it was, you. It was a good game because um, you know, it just it just fell right for you. A couple of a couple of things, and you you uh you you. You paid it off, but uh, thank you, Abby. We will see you in the final. Um, Cave, yeah. thank you. You just you just met a better a better competitor today, but you have had a hell of a tournament. Congratulations. Yes. Yeah, I did. I didn't expect to get that far, but you know, I mean, working against Abby is just you know impossible. GG, yeah. Abby. I'm really. Cave, thank you so much for taking part. You have been. Thank you, Cave. You have been it's a, been a wonderful pleasure. competitor, and I can see you going far in this sport. Um, Mm -hmm. Well, well done. We could have a third place playoff, uh, as King has suggested. Um, we could do that if if the losing semi finalists are up for it. I uh, I'm very much on board with that. But we are going to move on to our second semi final now. Jim, this this side of the draw has been pretty pretty tight, and we've got Fraz against Chubbs. Been incredibly tight uh i mean this you know i, I don't know what we're going to have exactly but it's going to be another cock battle uh of great proportion it's um it's great proportions great girth we've got we've got in this one north of england versus south of england um it's it's the age-old battle it's um magnificent hair against magnificent hair i mean jim yeah yeah I, I don't know what I don't know how to call this. Chubbs is actually winning the vote so far in the poll, but it's early days. King of the North. Uh, however, you know who's gonna be the. However, I I mean Fraz has been. Fraz has been solid. He has been 
Yes. Very, very, very confident solid. too. Uh, and uh, he has he has backed his he he's backed himself up. Uh, for, you know, yeah. the, there's been a lot of smack talk. There's been a lot of uh, cock swinging, um, literally mm. with the grapple hook. But mm -hmm. but he's he's backed it up. Can he can he do it? Chubbs is is a strong challenger. Yes, yes. No, I I think I think Chubbs has the length to go mile here, but I don't know. Um, I don't know if it's gonna be enough to uh, to beat off Fraz. It, it will take a lot to beat off Fraz. Um, yeah. But uh, if anyone can do it, if anyone can do it, uh, Chubbs can. And oh my goodness, Chubbs can guys, do it. look at the results. Oh, it's a tie. It was tied. This is 50 50. Absolute 50 50. Chat can't call it. Wow. We can't call it. Are you ready for the second semi final? Let's do it. Back to you, Jim. Thank you, Red. Back to you, Red. Back to me, Jim. Let's do this thing. Oh, my goodness. So, go, guys, good luck. Let's see how this second semifinal goes. Who is going to play Avi in the final? We got a cock and a pussy in this race. Who is going to win it? We are in theme park. This is it. Frass and Chubbs. Chubbs out early, also with the rocket. Ooh, my goodness. Okay, Frass with the early oh. lead. Chubbs struggling. Oh, quick win there by Frass. Oh, my goodness. Okay, here what they go. an early win that was. That's That's got it. A very early win, but you know what? Chubbs just needed to see that vertical again, and he's got it out in front on this second go here. Frass gonna... Ooh, he had to make that slide. Try and go for the freezy gun, and it's Chubbs! These are quick games, wow, but these... this is gonna be a wow. match, Jim. This is gonna be a match. 1-1. One, 1-1. One. One, one. Here we go. I think Frass underestimated Chubbs a little bit. Maybe a little too overconfident. I don't it know. It does seem like Chubbs, Chubbs... Chubbs likes coming from behind, Jim. He loves it from behind. That's where he get all the good angles. Frass now out in front. Ooh, a little slip up there by Chubbs. This is going to be a tricky vertical. Oh, but he saved it because Frass could not complete it as clean as he wanted. It's a, it was a messy completion. Chubbs hanging in there. Oh, my goodness. Chubbs going to have to make a, a, a little bit of a comeback here. Ooh, Frass hitting that first box. Very un -Frass like what a, ooh, attempting that perfect slide. Chubbs almost had it. That would have given a big lead. Ooh, also hitting those blocks as well. Frass back out in front as they hit out through the vertical once again. Oh, this is, this is, the lead is changing hands. Wow. Oh, and a quick grapple there as he runs into a speed boost through the amusement park. Oh my goodness gracious. But Chubbs hanging on, not too, not too quick here, says Chubbs. Still anyone's race, Jim. It is abs. I mean, it's Chubbs is definitely not holding a lead as strong or as as long as Frass is. But um, this could be the section. We all know Chubbs can come pretty quickly here. Oh, and he loses. It was the vertical. the vertical. That vertical section is a killer. It's brutal. It's brutal. Here they come. Okay. Beak. And whiskers now are these two. Chubbs has to get this wind. What a big grapple there. Chubbs trying to get some speed. Maybe trying to eliminate Fraz early. Chubbs just running for his life, but hits the oh no and sh oh no, Fraz ahead, but he does okay. Oh, wow. Back out in front. Oh the blocks! Chubbs oh, the grapple! Oh what a grapple! Oh, what a grapple, but he can't, can't capitalize on it. Stubbs. Oh, my God. Stubbs needs this. Look at this. Look at this play right here by the two of them. Slide. Both hitting in the blocks, going through the crates, trying the freezy gun. Cannot get it. Grappling for their lives. As they make the turn. Both missing the boxes. Good grapple there. Missing all of the crates. Ooh, Chubbs going down the, the, the bottom part. They head into the vertical. This could be where he is. 
Oh, Chubbs can't capitalize. Oh. I feel like I'm, okay. I feel like I'm at a music festival, Jim. This is so tense. Oh my God, they're coming around again. Nice slide by Chubbs heading over the crates. Frazz with a little speed boost. Both getting the grapple, very tight, very clean. Oh my goodness, they, I mean, they're just, they're both seeing this course with such effort. I mean, they haven't hit a block this whole time. This great, come on Discord, don't let us down now. Unbelievable, 18 seconds before the, the course starts to close on itself. Just completely in sync with each other. There was the first mistake in an entire round of this. Oh, and another oh, one. Oh, Frass hitting that crate. Here we go. But here comes the course. It's going to come down to the course. It's going to come down to the course closing. These two are so... Oh, Chubbs hitting that wall. That could be bad. Not a good time to start making some mistakes, Chubbs. But also Frass does as well. They tie it sort of back up. Oh, a big stop there. Heading into the vertical. Chubbs can make his effort here, but Frass... Carrying it through, well done by Frass. It's closing in. He can't keep up. Chubbs trying to escape oh, ahead. He oh, he jumps in on the, the vertical, vertical and ties it. I can't believe it, Jim. Wow. This is it. It comes down to we this. We have a decider again. Who, he will, who it will advance to the finals. It comes down to this. Chubbs and Frass. Ooh. Early mistake, a couple early mistakes by Chubbs. Frass has a big lead here. I'm shaking, Jim. Not good heading into the vertical. Chubbs, don't give up now, buddy. Oh my God. Oh my goodness gracious. Oh, trying to get the freezing gun. Cannot do it. Making the slide. There's the freeze. Oh, Chubbs gets ahead. Frass though, now right behind. Chubbs not used to being in the lead here. Great efforts, very clean run here by both contestants. Next time up into the vertical, this is where you can start to make some headway. He's done it! And he does! Chubbs! He's done it! Chubbs wins it! What a result, Jim! He called it! He called it at the start of the tournament! He said he was gonna meet Abby in the final, and look what's happening! Wow! Wow! I can't believe it, Jim. I, in the 20 years, Red, that we've been professionally doing this, I don't know if I've ever seen anything quite like that. That was the best match I've ever seen. Wow. Wow. Uh, un unbelievable. Uh, we we got we got to go right to them. We got We got to hear immediate reactions from this. Let's head down to the field. Uh, back to you, uh, Red. Back to you, Jim. Thank you. Uh, so let's talk. Let's talk to uh, to, to to Chubbs. Let's talk to Chubbs. Uh, Hello, my friend. My my dapper English fellow. Talk us through that. I, I mean, you came back. You won two in a row. You won to tie it. I mean, talk us through it. <laughs> I am drenched with sweat. My palms are sweaty. My knees are weak. I've got beer on my sweater. I'm scared. Chewy. I'm nervous. Wow. But I'm ready for Avi in the final. Oh, Chubbs. I, I called you it. called it. You called I mean, Chubbs, you, that was a, a prophecy. You laid out a prophecy at the beginning of this competition. I, I, I just saw it. I, I've not been sleeping. I've I've been running through the bracket in my brain for a week now, and I just saw it. I knew I had to avoid Avi. She is my kryptonite. I could take down the Brit, just somehow. But wow. Now it's Avi. You, yeah. Wow. Well Chubbs, done. You, Chubbs. You, you have taken out two of your fellow Brits. Uh, you're representing England uh, against Sweden. How are, you, how are you feeling about that? I'm going to do you proud. I'm going to do you proud. Look, we're all winners here, apart from Abby. <laughs> Excellent right. stuff. Right. Of course. No, classy to the end. Thank you, Chubbs. Congratulations, buddy. Uh, and good luck in the finals. Cheers. Uh, Frass. Hello. Buddy. Uh, listen. Uh, 
walk us through it. That um, uh, that was rough there. Look, I'm 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 glad I made it this far. I'm glad I I uh, got to face Chubbs. I'm just upset. I'm upset that I choked. You know, choking on Chubbs is just uh, it's upsetting. I'm upset. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, Chubbs will make he he makes you choke. I mean, he made everybody else before him. So it's true. It's true. I, I, uh, he's a fantastic competitor. So, uh, yeah. yeah, you know what? I, I'm, I'm happy. I'm happy with what I did so far. I mean, Frass, you will always be a, a, a good cock in my book. Thanks, man. Thanks. You got I it. I mean, uh, yeah. Well done. You, you, the big did, red cock has served me well. You, you raced, you raced very, very well and you came when you needed to. You did. Thank you. Just wasn't enough. I hope here. you can relax after this, you know. Get his, take a facial, something like that. Um, <laughs> I'm planning on it. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Cool. Glad to hear it. Thank you, gentlemen. Thank you. Thank you for us. Well, Jim. <clears throat> wow. We have our finalists. <laughs> we have our finalists. Yes, we do. And this is the biggest vote. Guys, there is a poll at the top of chat. Who Guys. is going to be the tournament champion? Is it going to be Avi? Is it going to be Chubbs? We are going to have uh, three matches. I uh, I don't know. Well, I, I we're in for a marathon here. Uh, I I don't think these will be quick matches. Uh, and I think it's gonna t it's this is not a sprint. As much as it's speed runners, this is a bit of a marathon. There's more psychological stuff going on here. Um, but I I don't know. I I mean, Avi is very strong, but uh, holy buckets, Chubbs. I mean, it's tie right now, fifteen apiece. Look at this vote. It's um. It's it's tight. I can't call this. Uh, it's best of three. Uh, oh, Jim, I I am very very excited for this. Um, it's shall you. we? Oh, cave points are good too. Should we? Should cave we maybe keyboard versus controller? Should we maybe say thank you to everyone after the after the poll is done? I think we should. I think should. I should say thank you. Also, thank you very much for that resub. Very kind of you, Professor. Thank you so much. Um. We have some keys to give away of speedrunners. And let's do it in chat. Once the poll is ended, we'll do a giveaway. You'll just need to type a word. I will tell you when it's open. Uh, you'll have two minutes to enter. Uh, wow. Look at this vote, Jim. Look at this vote. Yeah. yeah. It's, it's neck and neck. Unbelievable. Absolutely unbelievable. I... It, it just keeps flip flopping it's, back and this forth. Is, this is glorious to see. It's fifty fifty. It's the most votes we've had too. Wow, most votes. Fifty two votes in here. It's incredible. Uh, I, you know, I, Jim, the even, poll was fifty fifty. Wow, wow. I mean, it's this is this is a close call. And wow. Wow. You know, you know what it is? It's it's really tough. And I think the reason it's tough to call is because Abby has been so strong this whole time, right? She's been consistent. Everyone knew it was coming from Abby. But what we weren't expecting is Chubbs just driving this completely home. I mean, he got so much better yeah. through this competition. Absolutely. And now he's at the top of his game. He, you know, he had to go the long route uh he didn't win the group it was a tight group but uh yep and as i mean as wife po po uh you know posted here you won't choke on chubs you got this you can handle this is going to be this is going to be a, a great match but guys let's have a giveaway uh so i need you all now to type run just type run now in chat so you can win Sit. a chance. You can win the giveaway. Run. Type run. run. I think this is a good time for Red and I to say how honored we are, even though we've been doing this 20 years professionally. Uh, and this is really, but this has been a very spectacular uh, uh, speedrunners tournament. Uh, one of our best, at least our top 17 yeah, best yeah. that we've done. Uh, you know, and we've only done, you know, third, 20, 20 of them. So it's top 17. Pretty good. Pretty good. 
Speedrunners tournament. It's, it's, uh, it's honestly, yeah. Um, it is a privilege to to be able to cast this sport. Um, like uh, like the greats. Um, you know, like I said earlier, Barry Jenkins, rest in peace. Um, rest in peace. Yeah. We ha- Arturo, Arturo rest in peace. Uh, Tiny Tim, Fancy Pete. Yeah. All of them Francisco, rest in peace. Rest in peace. Speedrunners don't live no, very no, long. No, no, it's it is it is a brutal sport. It, it's yeah, yeah. It it claims lives and hearts. Um, it does. Generally, lead foot comes into the play, and you just end up speeding too much, and there's a lot of car accidents uh, from it, and running accidents. I mean, you yeah, it's just the way it goes. Uh, we hope that this won't be the case for Chubbs or Abby, uh, depending on you know who wins this, but. I'm just, wow. I'm just, I'm just happy to be here, Jim, uh, and to witness. Me too. Just to, just to witness this. Red, it, you know, in the twenty years, I'd like to say something to you, Red. In the twenty years we've been doing this, I really appreciate your friendship and the fact that we can call uh, yet another speedrunners tournament oh, together. It's, it's every, every year. It's a pleasure. It's been a professional pleasure. Um. Professional. Can I ask someone, a mod, to uh, take note of who our winners are, please? Guys, thank you all for entering. Uh, that is the most entries I've ever had for a giveaway. Um, oh, did I mention? We're actually giving away 10 keys. Whoa! 10! 10. 10 keys. 10! 10. 10 speedrunners keys. Yeah, so we're picking ten winners. I did I did I not mention that? Oh, so ten of you are gonna win. Oh, uh, ten of you are gonna win. You're so cheeky, Red. You're so thank, cheeky, and that's why I thank love you. Thank you so much to Tiny Build once again. Really, really grateful. Um, okay, we're gonna pick winners now. Thank you guys for writing it down. Uh, our first winner is Nit KP. Congratulations. KP. KP is our first winner. Knit one play two is our first winner. Totally rigged. By the way, uh, Jim, rigged. I don't know if you've seen KP's Photoshop, but uh, they have <clears throat> made Jim weird. I I actually briefly saw it, and um, I'm going to spend some time with that photo later. Yeah. Fair. Me too. Next winner is Schnitz and Giggle. One of my favorite usernames on Twitch. Wow. Wow. Congratulations. Schnitzy. Congratulations, Schnitz and Giggle. We will get the keys to you um, ASAP. Obviously, you know, bear with us. Um, yeah, but congratulations, Schnitzy. Our third winner, Raylan. Okay, this is rigged. <laughs> Raylan's my mod. <laughs> Ooh, yep, rigged. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Our system is absolutely, totally, it's totally, rigged. absolutely, it's rigged. totally rigged. Okay, winner number yeah, four. His marker. Congratulations, his marker. It's rigged. <laughs> nice, nice. Congratulations, his marker. You are our next winner. Uh, that's four. Yes, I can count. Uh, hang on. Oh, wait. If my math checks out, that means there's six left. There are six left. I'm having an issue with the giveaway. Hang on. What's going math. on here? Hello there. Uh, thank you for the follows. Uh, there he is. There's his marker. Thank you, dude. Congratulations. Six left, right? Number five. Winner is... Professor, Professor ISD Rage, congratulations, buddy. Thank you, Ifo. Congratulations. We have five. You want a key for speedrunners? His marker. Number six, the Peachy Queen. Congratulations. The Peachy Queen is number six. Guys, this is very exciting. Very exciting. Who's going to be number seven, Jim? That's the question. I'm going to guess <clears throat> number seven is King Argaroth because he rigged it's it. Dude Mithut is number seven. That was my next guess. Good guess. 
Thank you. Good guess, Jim. Thank uh, you. Number eight. Back to number you, Red. Number eight is Lenzo. Congratulations, Lenzo. You are a wiener. Um, oh, dude, hang on. Dude's giving their key away to someone. Do I what? Should I pick another winner? If dude, if you don't want it, that's fine. But I will pick another winner. Um, was that number eight? I think that was number eight, wasn't it? His marker already has it as well. Hard to okay. say. Okay, ten is a very big okay. number. So, so we've still got. He says, "Yeah, pick another okay, one." Okay, yeah. so we've actually still got four more to do. Then, if his marker and dude both have it, we'll pick again. Sorry, guys. So take off his marker and dude. Next winner is Pudsy. 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 Congratulations. Yay. Congratulations. You deserve it. Pudsy is a big supporter of Nook Streamers. Real. Great, great human being. Congratulations, Puds. I hope you like the game. It's it's great fun. Uh, so that was number... I've lost count now. That was number seven. Seven? That was seven. Yeah. Okay, we've got three more. Yeah. Sorry for those of you writing these down. <laughs> Mandy! You don't apologize, Red. We're professional. Mandy! 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 Okay. Mandy is number eight. You got this, Sal. Thank you so much. Number nine, Clavicus. Clavicus, hey. congratulations. And that's one more. Am I right? I think nine plus one. Yes. One more? One. All right, guys. Yeah. It's Hungry for Vengeance. Congratulations, Hungry for Vengeance. Congratulations. And thank you, everyone, for entering. There is still a chance to win uh, if you follow the Nook on Twitter, the Nook Twitch, at the Nook Twitch. Uh, we uh, stick it in the uh, mod chat in um, the Nook Discord, please, South. Uh, just tag me, please. Um, we'll send those out as soon as we can. Congratulations, everyone. Uh, Raylan, thank you so much as well. You just sent me the list too. Thank you very much, guys. Um. Okay. There is still a chance to win on Twitter. So uh, good luck. Well done. And uh, thank you for entering. Okay, Jim. So the final time is here. Here we are. Avi versus Chubbs. Three matches, two streamers, one winner. Let's, let's, let's do it. Uh, let's do it. I, uh, again, can you see it in my face? I am excited. I am excited, Red. Can you see it in my face? So much. Okay, Jim. I'm going to ask you. I'm going to ask you. Who do yeah. you think is going to win? I'm unbiased. Of course. Professionals. But. Uh, professionals. But I will pick Abby. I'm going to go for Chubbs then. Okay. Correct person. Doesn't do a shoey. Ooh. All right. Okay. Game set and match, sir. We're unbiased. Uh, so, totally unbiased. Guys, we're professional, unbiased, unprofessionals, professionals. Okay. All right. Let's do it. Just to interject very quickly, oh uh, those who won the giveaway in chat, uh, you will be getting a whisper from Twiggy shortly with your game key. Thank you, Twiggy. Thank you, voice of Tug. Thank you, God. Hello, Jim. This is God Free Jones. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Cap, Cap, uh, I don't know what you're talking about. <clears throat> I don't know what you're talking about. Okay, uh, let's. Uh, I've got to. I've got to capture this stream. But uh, it's Abby against Chubbs. I am so hyped for this. Do you want to take this I'll one? Take the first match. Don't forget, and we've then, got three. Uh... We've got three. I'll take the second, and then you take the sure. third. So back to you, Red. Back to you, Jim. Back to you. Thank you, Red, but back, back to you. Thank you, Jim. Back to me. 
There we go. All right. Yeah, we, yeah. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> Goddess boat. Mm. Okay, Avi, Chubbs, I tell you what, can we can we have a little chat with you both first? Um, just before, how how are you feeling going into this match, Avi? I am in a panic. Okay. Okay. Thanks. Not what we want to hear, Avi. I gotta. I don't want to do a shoey. That's so. the truth. Fair enough. Okay. Good luck, Chubbs. How are you feeling? If you didn't know, I'm a vegan, so I literally eat avocados for breakfast every day. Wow. Chubbs, I'm ready damn. Oh, damn. baby, look at this confidence. Damn. Let's do this, guys. <laughs> Let's go. Final time. Jailbird against cat. Wow. Convict against kitten. Mm. Perp against pussy. Ooh, in festival. And we are underway Here we go. in the festival. This is a tough map, this one. This should be good. We've got Chubbs and Avi in the final. Remember, guys, it's a best of three. Best of three. We are not counting the number. It's just they win the match. And if it's 3-2 or 3-0, it doesn't matter. It's best of three. I believe that's what we're doing anyway. Um, yes. Yes, and yes. Uh, we've got Avi taking an early lead. The grapple doesn't quite work there for Chubbs, but it doesn't matter because Avi slightly screws up. This is... Fascinating viewing, guys. I can't believe this. What a game we have got in store here. This is the final of the Nook Speedrunners Tournament. Uh, wow. You, you are witnessing the pinnacle of human athleticism right here. We have got Abby. Absolutely. We've got Chubbs. This is a close run thing. Chubbs has had the lead from most of this match, but that doesn't mean anything. We know Abby's got tricks up her sleeve. Yeah. But Ooh. Chubbs on Ooh. the vertical. Chubbs has been nailing the vertical all the way through this tournament. The vertical is in his strength. But Avi keeps it going. Launches a rocket. rocket. It hits Chubbs. But Avi slightly messes up the grapple. She has got the lead, but not as much as you would thought she would get. Wow. This is absolutely fascinating. We've got Avi in the lead now. But Chubbs keeping it going. Could this, could this really be... This, an epic this could, is going to come down could we could to, we get three someone making a mistake in the wrong time avi with the wonderful turn there on the drop that was excellent work i thought she had slightly screwed it up but she actually picked it up that was superb running here comes the vertical avi nailing but look chubbs again so quick on the verticals he's really got those nailed down i've been very impressed with that Jim. wow very very impressed indeed. really yeah, impressed it's, it's been, yeah it's it's been solid vertical chub all the way there we go all the way but i think we're going to end up closing in on this thing almost every Absol time i mean these two are just consummate absolutely look at this this is wonderful the lead is changing that was an excellent grapple dodge by chubs guys i don't know who's going to win this match this is going to be so close we could be here for the next 13 years at this rate I'm really excited, but what an excellent turn. Avi nailing that turn once again. Yes. And that time it counted. Avi takes the first game in this match. Don't forget, best of three matches. It's 1-0. Did she rock it immediately? Yeah, quick, there was a rocket straight at the star. That was interesting. The pick up right at the beginning. Very, very interesting. But the avocado, the criminal in the lead. But it's only 1-0, guys. And this is a close-run thing. However, Ch Chubbs... Wow! Oh, my goodness! The oh. reverse grapple! Oh, that's not a move you see every wow. day, Jim. That's not a move you see every day. No! Not at all. That was incredible. The flip reverse it. That is a wonderful move by Avi. However, it might not pay off because Chubbs has the lead, but he hits the crates on the way down. Now, we know Avi's really good at this section. She has hit a crate, though, and Chubbs still has the lead. And we've got the vertical coming up, remember? We know Chubbs is strong on the vertical. However, Avi has closed the gap really well. Very impressive. And keeps up with Chubbs on the vertical. That's very impressive stuff. Guys, we could be having a very long match here. I'm very excited. That wow. one was a good hit. But Avi gets knocked out. This is a huge chance for Chubbs. And he hits the crate. And what a grapple by Avi. Oh. This is amazing stuff. This game is turning up and down so often. I can't believe this. 
Avi really trying to press that advantage now, but it's not over yet. Chubb still very much in this game. This is a this this is the final we all wanted. This is the final we all deserved. And now Chubb's nailing the turn this time. We've got the vertical section coming up very soon, but it's so neck and neck. I cannot believe how close this match is. Guys, we are going to wow. be here for a long time. I hope you're ready to watch this final because you are in for a treat. Laid back with a beer has made it wow. right for the final. Welcome on in. We are having an amazing final here. We're right at the start. It's 1-0 to Avi in the first match. The rocket Ooh, what a... misses. Wow. But what is this? This wow. is amazing. They've sped up. Look at I can't believe what I'm speed. seeing here. The screen is closing in, Jim. It's... This is a... It, it, I mean, there's there's no other way to eliminate these they're two. Just, yeah, they, someone's going to force their hand. Could we get the famous postage stamp finish? It could still happen, Jim. Yes. Wow. I really hope so. Look Close at them both. They been. are so tight. Their thumbs are going to be really doing the old workout right now. We also should re remind everybody this is keyboard versus controller. Uh, as was stated earlier by yeah, Cave. Yeah, keyboard versus controller. Big, big difference, but not having a huge effect. Look how close this no. is. Chubb can't press the advantage. They're neck and neck. Avi taking the lead. Look how small the screen is getting, guys. I oh can't believe my. what I'm seeing. And, oh my goodness, Chubbs. How, what? What just happened? Jim. Wait. What just happened? I'm not sure. Chubbs won it somehow. I don't... Wait. Wait, no, wait, what? Wait. Chubbs is disconnected, I think. What's just... What's going on? Okay. It's 2-2. Two, two. I'm not sure what happened in that third round. Uh, Chubbs had an issue okay. there. I... It's 2-2, two, two, though, guys. We've got a decider in the first match. I don't know what's happening. In all I... my years... I think I think they're just trying to make it interesting. I think they're playing with us a little bit in here. In all my years, Jim. Oh, Avi on the vertical. I've never seen anything like this. Look at Chubbs, though. He's pressing your advantage. Remember, the winner of this round takes the first match. Best of yes. three matches. This is a huge round here right now. Huge. The Ooh. grapple misses from Avi. The grapple from Avi. Oh, I think Chubbs threw the second game to make it fair. You might be right there, Kira, because I'm pretty sure uh. Avi was in front and Chubbs got the win for some reason. That is a classy Very Chubbs classy. move. Very uh, classy. You love to see the sportsmanship. Uh, he is a classy gent. He wears a bow tie and plays the ukulele. But Avi is an avocado, and they are True. always stoned. Um, so does that have an effect? Right. I don't know. I don't know. We'll find out. Ooh, this is Clever rocket there. It's not going to land. This is very, very classy. That was a block, and this could be this could be it. No, not yet. Chubbs messes up, though. That's it. Boy, it's over. Avi takes the first match. Wow. What a game. Jim, 3-2. Wow. 3-2. Wow. I mean, if that's any indication of the next two here, I mean... Unbelievable. Goodness gracious. Unbelievable All right. speed running, Jim. Oh, it's 1-0 to Avi. Unbelievable. It's 1-0. Okay. Uh, I've just been one right. second before you start the next match. Sorry, I've just got to check something. Uh, my uh, thing is being weird. Oh, my God. What the hell happened there? Uh, we had some glitches, but it was all fine. It worked. Uh, and, wow. Um... I, uh, I, I, I'm lost for words, Jim. I, I am too. I just, I just, uh, we just witnessed level quality liquid speedrunners. Everyone's a winner as far as I'm concerned. You know, you know what, Jim? Speedrunners is the winner today. Absolutely. Absolutely. Um, okay. We're ready for match. Okay. We're ready for match number two. Match two. And, uh, Jim, <clears throat> uh, back to you. Okay, thank you, Red. Back to you. Thank you, Jim. Uh, I will you. go back to you. Thank you, Red. Back to me. Here we go. We are ready for uh, round two of this heavyweight fight between the avocado and the dapper Can English. Can Chubbs gentleman. force a decider? 
Wow. Wow, wow, wow. And they're off. This is, uh, forgot what the, the map was called. Moonlight? Map. Yeah, that's definitely it. Something. Yep. Professional. Okay, a lot of mistakes here early on. Professional. A lot of mistakes here early on, uh, from both of them. Uh, Abby does have the lead. They're gonna, they're gonna probably take a little bit of time just to get the feel for the course once again, but Chubb's really wow. great grapples here. Whoa, just fantastic. That was so smooth, Jim. Uh, sailing over this course. Uh, okay, the vertical leaps. Abby handling it a little bit better. They head up through the VIP lounge. Uh, Chubb's making a very weird and awkward grapple. Not sure what that was about. Did they go? Abby's going over. Chubb's going under. Rocket, oh, the rocket is out. It has hit Avi, but Chubbs could not capitalize, and Avi picks back up the lead very early on. As they head down into the party room, Chubbs, this is his strong point. Avi's going to have to catch back up. Oh, Chubbs hitting that block. Not great. Avi and Chubbs swinging through the speakers. Seems like a, Abby a getting course. both those drops, but she's dropping the crates. Those crate drops by Avi, very, very well placed. She knows how to use the tools that she's given. There is the Ooh. boulder. It is out, but it has missed. Both doing a little speed boost here. As they head into the third lap, 30 seconds left before the map starts closing. Jim, this is anyone's game. They are both. Initially, it was Avi was better on the top part. Chubbs on the bottom, yep. but it's, it's, it's neck and neck again. Chubbs is always better on the bottom. Absolutely. He's a good bottom. From what I've learned. Bottom. Yeah. Yes. Oh, Jim. Here they come. Eight seconds left. Avi has trouble with those crates, but Chubbs is getting hit by the ID. He's done. Oh, Chubbs is out on the first one. That late crate at the bottom there. Oh, the late crate. You don't want a late, late crate. crate. Is, you, is always a big one. You, oh, no. And no, Chubbs. Another quick drop. <gasps> Avi up to nothing. Chubbs has got to figure out quickly how he can make that vertical leap. Jim, it, Jim, Chubbs going to get Abby in his own head one about this. round away from being the new. And Avi now struggling. Wait. But saves it. And the rocket boom. It's all over, Jim. It's over. Wow. It's wow. Over, Jim. A, a flawless victory there by Avi. <laughs> wow. wow. That was criminal, Jimmy. That was. That was. A surprise at the end. That was really, really wow. unlucky there. One mistake. Yeah, that's. I mean, that's what it took. That is all it took. Uh, it was a good showing early on, but that last bit at the end there uh, yeah. was. Avi is the champion. <sighs> Avi, the winner. Congratulations, Avi. Thank you. Won. you. Very Gee, much. Geez. A lot of people called it. Man, that was tense. Wow. We did have a bit of a glitch there in the first yeah, game. Yeah, I thought uh, thought I saw yeah. um there was a, a funny one because you were you were ahead but Chubbs won. For some reason one of us got tel instantly teleported off the screen in one game and then in the second game the other one got teleported off the yeah. screen. So we insta died. Mm. One one each. We got one yeah. insta death. Oh, at each least there. at least it was one each. That was fair. But uh, that yeah. second match you uh yeah, I got a few opportunities there to crush him, and I managed to take well him. Well done. I'm pretty wow. happy about it. Uh, but he played really, really well. How does it... Yes. So it was a pleasure. How does it feel to be officially the best speedrunner in the world? I genuinely did not expect to win. I thought that... I thought that Fraz would win. I was sure of it. Um, and I'm just grateful that Chubbs uh, eliminated him. And... Uh, wow. Yeah. Um, uh, I'm, Abby, more importantly... How does it feel to have to be the winner of this, knowing that you have the commentators are consummate professionals of the speedrunning world, such as Red and I? It is it is a true honor to be a part of this uh, extremely prestigious speedrunners event um, right. that has right. never been seen before on this level. It's really, really just a once in a lifetime opportunity. I I, st I see yeah. that the um. The, the smack talk is is still going. Fraz mentioning that he and he and Fraz, Abby never yeah. actually met. Uh, so we've still got we've got that to look forward to one day, Jim. But what a tournament! 
Yeah. Yeah. Well, congratulations, Abby. Let's, let's talk, uh, let's well talk to our runner-up. Well um, Thank you very much. Let's talk to our runner-up who, who seen yes. off two of the favorites but couldn't quite make it three. Chubbs, con well done for making to the final. Bad luck there, but you you got to be proud. It was one hell of a run, you know. It, it, the whole redemption arc from coming second in groups to beating Manovners, beating Drongo. Yeah. I, I, even I believed. It was, but yeah, no. you had that extra match. You did. I think it was one too many, two too squeaky games for me. Yeah. I need to lie it, down. I just, it's, a, it's a marathon. This was a marathon event. Uh, uh, it really was. It was uh, it was an epic, and i got to say, Jim, well done to every single competitor. They brought their A-game today, and uh, that, like I said, still very much in the top 17 of tournaments that we have casted. Yep. It's very close to even top it 16. Be, yeah. Not quite, but it could be, but not quite. We can, we can always debrief on that later. But... Uh, really happy with the performances we've seen here today. Uh, and thanks to everyone who came out to watch this event and 134 million people, like incredible. Thank you. It's... If I could interject here real quick, uh, the team would like to thank Red and Jim for an absolutely incredible job commentating on today's matches uh chat if we could show them some love they did a fan freaking tastic job it has been so entertaining to watch i've been glued to the screen well done you thank two. you tug hey thank we you guys thank you yes uh this this team is uh is a special special place full of some magical people and uh we're all very lucky um to know each other and um so thank you to everyone. Thank you guys all who watched. This was a lot of fun. I know Red and I had a blast. Oh, yeah. Um, and uh, thank you for letting us let's do this. Let, thanks for letting us come into your homes and and be goofy and silly with all of you. <clears throat> you guys are wonderful. Yeah, uh, Jim, I I've had so much fun uh, casting it with you. Um, it, it's been an absolute pleasure. Thank you for for joining, uh, and thank you to the guys at the Nook for trusting me to host this on my channel. Um. It, it is an honor. Uh, it's it. Oh, just I've had a great time, and um, we've got so much more coming up with the Nook. We, you know, we've always yeah. got stuff going on. We've got more tournaments. We've got team events. We've got everything going on. We've got the big dig stuff starting on Monday. The Minecraft uh, relay. It's it's honestly, if you you need to follow everyone in the Nook um, because they're all wonderful yeah. people and fantastic streamers and entertainers mm -hmm. uh yes. and uh that that's it thank you all for joining um i uh i think there's one more thing to do though jim i think there is red i've been trying to put this off uh-huh but i um i lost <clears throat> didn't i you did actually i, I lost yeah okay you know what this means, fam. You know what this means. Here we go. I take back what I said. <laughs> oh, I'm a bit. That I'm a bit looks like a nice shoe. Realized. That looks like a really nice shoe. If I'm honest. Fuck. Good luck to you, my friend. Okay. There it is. Just to prove oh, yeah. it's going in. Oh, yeah. That's going to be good. That's going to be good. Bottoms up, sir. Taken like a true English gentleman. Red Weird! Ladies and gentlemen, what a shoey. Oh, yes, that's the face you want. Well done, sir. Well done. Well mildly done. cheesy. Mmm, yummy. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I, I deserve that. I went against Avi. I went against Avi. Mm -hmm. uh, thank you all for yep. being yep. here. Yep. Yep. We are going to raid a Nookian. We're going to raid. We're going to do a raid. So if you can join us for this, I'm just going to put some music on. Why not? Let's uh, do it. Finish it with start. We're going to raid Hecky. Hecky is doing a 12 hour stream 
And right now she's doing Twitch things. Ah. She's doing Twitch things. Beautiful. Um, Beautiful. Has anyone got an idea for a raid message? Mm. We need we need something good. Uh, do we? Uh, or should we just do the Nook message? We could just do the Nook message. Let's do the Nook. Yeah. That's a good idea, dude. Do nook, Team man. Nook, all the Nook. Bling, bling, bling. <laughs> Let's just, just spam the Nook. That's a good idea. If you've got those emotes, if not, just... Yeah. What a heck of an anniversary. Yeah. Oh, that's brilliant. That's brilliant. brilliant. Guys, it's been an absolute pleasure. Yes. Thank you so much for tuning in. I know a lot of you don't normally, you know, you haven't seen me before. You may not have seen Jim before. Go and follow Jim, J Jam Jim, on Twitch. Please follow this man, this this dude. Oh, thank you, Red. Because he's fantastic. It's been, a, it's been a pleasure, Red. It's been a pleasure uh, to to do this with you, my friend. Thanks for thanks for uh, thanks for having thank me. Thank you for backing it to me. You back to you, thank Red. You. Um, guys, professional raid is underway let's give her all the love thank you so much for being here remember uh there's a tweet the nook twitch on twitter you can still win keys we are probably still gonna have more keys to give away at some point so don't forget and uh we will see you when we see you for another team event but honestly it's been an absolute pleasure and i, I know i speak for all of us when we say we really appreciate all the support you give us by watching, mm -hmm. by hosting, by chatting, by lurking, and any of that. So, um, yes. Stay awesome, stay weird, stay beautiful, and uh, we will see you soon. Let's raid Hecky. Bye, Jim. Bye, everyone. Bye, everyone. Bye, Red.